Hello, hello. Sorry, that was a sudden stop to the music. I should have let it, like, fade out. But, you know, we didn't do that. What is up, Barry? How are you? Thank you for joining our Discord and actually talking in our Discord. We're bad about not using it regularly, so I appreciate people using it. How's it going? Big thank you to my beloved Nerd Candy for you for making our beautiful new starting screen. It's super adorable. Let's see. All right, we're going to get started with Pokemon Snap. I've never played it before, um, so it's all new to me. I can't wait. It's going to be good times. Excuse me while I slurp on my drink. How are you today, Barry? I hope things are going well. I think you said it's like, what, 4 in the morning or something like 4.30 in the morning? I could be wrong. I couldn't sleep. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Let's see. It's almost 5, yeah. Yeah, I remember you saying it was like, my starting time was like 4.30 a.m. your time, I believe. I'm trying to be better about using the Discord, too. Yeah. I've got to work on that. And then... He was updating the um, the Instagram today that we have because I have also been neglecting that. I'm just, I'm not good at social media anymore. I used to be so on top of it, but now I'm not. So. Um, I wanted to go to sleep to be up for this uh, and my friend, but I can't, I couldn't sleep. Wait, I wanted to go to sleep to be up for this and my friend, but I couldn't sleep. Oh, I see what you're saying. No worries. You know, stuff happens. Sometimes you can't go to sleep when you want to. All right, I guess I'm gonna go ahead and start, get through this tutorial because I'm sure it's gonna be, um, I'm sure it's gonna be lengthy. Grubhub got me tacos right on time. And hi, hello, Apple Glass, I'm so happy you got food delivered in a timely manner. We also had tacos today, we had Taco Bell, you know. Not great tacos, but, you know. Well, I mean, they're good to me, but, I know there are higher quality tacos out there. I mean, that's what I had. Okay. Don't turn off the power when the auto icon is kind of shown. Okay. Yeah. Taco Bell, you know, it's trash food, but it's also delicious, so. And I'm glad it actually made it to your house, you know, within, you know, five hours or at all. Select your language. English. Mm. Do I want no voices? No, we'll go with English. I don't think they talk a whole lot in this. I'm not sure. Please select your appearance. Hmm. 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 Who do I want to be? I guess that one's the closest to me, but I don't usually make my characters to look like me, so. Mm. I don't know, I'm feeling those two, but I guess I'll go with this one, because it looks like me. Whatever. Uh, so basic fast food, yeah, ex ex you know, it is what it is. It's usually trash food, but it usually tastes decent. Yeah, I'll just go with him. Whatever. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I guess I'll put my, my Twitch name instead. I'm sorry I missed your stream today, Apple. I It's been a hectic day. <laughs> but I hope it went well. And like always, y'all let me know if I need to adjust my microphone or the game audio. Oh, look at the little bo Oh my god, those are some of my favorite insect Pokemon in the game. Bug Pokemon, excuse me. Oh yeah. Oh, 
Also, I'm old and there's almost a thousand Pokemon now, so forgive me if I don't remember every single name. I do my best, but I can't always remember. Hi there, I'm glad you made it. Welcome to the Laboratory of Ecology and Natural Sciences, or LENS for short. Oh, I forgot to put on, um, uh, hold on, let me, let me get on the Discord, I'm trying to be professional about things, and put that I'm going live. Sorry, one moment. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Starting Pokemon Snap. Oh my goodness, my chubby fingers. Okay. <clears throat> I put it on the Discord. So. I saw on Instagram. I hope everything is okay now. Um, you okay, Torn? <laughs> um, it was just a hectic, stressful day. Um, I won't get into it on here, but yeah, <laughs> it's fine. Things are fine. It's just a lot of little things that start piling up and get to you after a while. But thank you all for asking. I'm doing all right. Stoutland, yes. I don't hear voices. Yeah, this is weird. Um, they do, like, it's like they'll do an occasional line, but for the most part, it's just text. So I'm not really sure why they bothered to put in a few lines. I guess so they wouldn't have to pay people as much. I don't know. My name is Mirror. I'm researching Pokemon and their natural environment here on Florio Island. Yeah, like that. Very bizarre. Like, what does that add? I don't get it. Yeah, and that's not all. The professor is going to study every single island here in the Lentil region. No one's ever done an ecolog ecological survey like this before. It's going to be amazing. No one? Aren't you forgetting a certain explorer? Yeah, you dummy. Oops, good point. You've read the stories of Captain Vince, haven't you? But even counting him, Professor, your survey is going to be the first of its kind in a hundred years. That's awesome. Thank you. Well, thanks. This is Rita. <gasps> Rita Rapunzel? Are you related? Wait, I guess not. She could kind of be related, though. She kind of looks like her. Her parents are good friends of mine, and she's here on vacation while her school's on break. Jeez. I'm not just here to goof off, Professor. I'm your research assistant. She does look super cute, though, I will say that. Ah, uh, yes, that's right, and I appreciate the help. Anyway. He's kind of adorable, too. Now, before we go over what you'll be doing in this program, why don't we step into the lab and get settled? Yeah. And show as online in Discord, or rather, show as streaming. I don't know how to do that. How do I do that? <laughs> I don't know these things. Right you are, Professor. I'll lead the way. All right, allow me to explain. User settings streamer mode. Hold on, let me, let me, let me see. Let me enable streamer mode. Hmm. I feel like I'm 900 years old trying to figure this stuff out. Discord is still mind boggling to me. User settings, streamer mode? Hmm. I don't... See. Activity settings? Display current activity as a status message. Hmm. Account? Yeah, I'm not seeing it. Set a custom status? I don't know. It's showing that I'm online. I don't know. It will be easier on the computer. Okay. I'm going to give it like 
three minutes. If, if I can't figure it out, then we'll just continue with the game. Hold on. Let's see. Uh, da, 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 da. Hmm. User settings. Oh. User settings. Okay. Streamer mode enabled. Okay. Yeah, it says it's enabled. Wait. Enable streamer mode. Okay, it's on. Yeah, it says everything's enabled. So yeah, I don't know why it's not. I don't know. Okay, let me open back up. There we go. Turn off and back on again. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. Bear with me, friendos. Um, okay, turn it off, turn it back on. There's an option where it says hides emails connected accounts. Would that be, do I need to turn that off? <clears throat> there you go. Okay, it's working. Awesome. Thank you. I appreciate that. I updated the Instagram as well. Thank you, my love. Okay. <clears throat> Thank you much, Apple Glass. I appreciate that. <clears throat> the lentil region is absolutely teeming with Pokemon. Photographing those Pokemon helps us learn more about them and their ecosystem. And that's exactly what you're here to do. At night, you might even get to see glowing Pokemon. They're really pretty. Now, without further ado, here's your research camera. I've got the same one. We can use them to communicate with each other and the rest of the team, too. That's right. It's more than just a camera. It lets you keep in touch and analyze data on the fly. It'll also serve as a sort of ID badge for you here, so take good care of it. That seems impractical, but okay. Okay, I'm kind of adorable. Awesome, right? The professor invented it. Can I explain how to use it, professor? Sure thing, Rita. Assist away. I'll go take care of some other preparations. All right, come on. Let's go outside. Tutorials are based on default button layouts. Can always confirm if you go to someone else's Discord and see if it shows you live. It will typically show you live in your Discord, even if it's glitched. Huh. That's weird. Aha, perfect timing. It's not letting me move the camera around. I guess I gotta wait until it's like right in the center, maybe? Okay. I guess it wanted me to take three. Now why don't you try moving the camera to line up your dots? See that circle in the center of your viewfinder? Mm -hmm. That's called the pointer. A if pointer, you, you say? To move the pointer around, the camera will move the following. That doesn't sound right. Give it a try. You can point the camera up and down, and even spin all the way around left or right. Oh, you can go all the way around. You can no, thank you. Okay, so I will say right up front, I've been playing Pokemon and watching Pokemon and loving Pokemon since the very first day it aired in America. I hate Pikachu. I wish that Pikachu was not the, uh, the face of Pokemon because, like, I can't stand Pikachu. He's overrated and I'm tired of seeing merchandise with him. There's almost a thousand Pokemon now, and they keep putting him and Eevee all over everything. Hot take from Torn. Whatever. Mm -mm. I can't be the only person that feels that way. I love my Pukachu. I mean, he I, 
but he's just not as special as they make him out to be. Like, whatever. See, now it's not letting me move at all. So I guess it's just wanting me to press the button. Okay. That's it. Great job. Whole body. She said whole. Whole body smack dab in the middle of the frame looking big. Okay. I did have a few years of college, thank you. Camera and motion. Okay. Okay, because I think some people said you needed to like speed up or slow something down. Common Witch, hello! Pika Pikachu! Yeah, I just um, went over that I am not a fan of Pikachu, but it's okay. I know a lot of people are. How's it going, Common? I'm sorry I missed your um, your stream. I got on Discord. I had to take a nap because I only slept like three hours last night and had a long day. Um, and when I woke up, I saw that you had been streaming, so I apologize for missing it, but I hope you're doing well. You'll want your Pokemon's hole right in the middle of the screen. <laughs> It'll be like the butthole rug on Animal Crossing. How was that? I hope you're getting the hang of your research camera. I was live for like five minutes before my internet ruined everything, so you didn't miss much. Oh, oh no, I'm sorry. That sucks when stuff like that happens. Anyway. And I know you played, um, I might have mentioned this before, I don't know, my memory is terrible, but, um, you know, I wanted to catch your Tell Me Why streams, but at the same time, I'm planning on playing that, so I didn't want spoilers, so... I haven't been able to catch many streams lately, I'm sorry. <laughs> but the love is there, I hope you under you, you understand. Now then, I'll evaluate the photos you took. Would you mind choosing one shot of each Pokemon you photograph? I'll rate them using my special scoring system. Pick whichever shots you think are best. Alright. Also, I feel like you... Oh, wait. Hold on. Also, I feel like you. I like Pikachu, but he's definitely not my favorite. Yeah. There's just so many at this point. There's so many cool ones. And I just hate that they keep putting him on all of the merchandise. Try selecting that. Oh, you get a folder for each one. Okay. You can choose a photo. Or I'm moving for her. Press A when you've decided which one to show me. Oh, I was trying to do it and okay, I see. It was still in the tutorial thing. Tutorial. Vivian. Vulpix is my fave personally, followed closely by Finnegan. Finnegan is so adorable. And I love like the real world animal that it's based off of. We have some at the zoo uh here. And they're just so freaking precious. I just wanna rub my face on them. Okay, I got more pictures than this one. They, whatever, they kept the most garbage one there was. I call shenanigans. Press plus or select show professor when you're ready. Okay. Uh, wait, what animal is it based off of? I assumed a fox, but there is a particular breed. Oh yeah, they are, um, it's called the Finnick Fox, so Finnegan. Um, but yeah, they pretty much look exactly the same, so. I cannot play this game. Why is that? Is it too uh, simplistic and silly? Starting with photo number one, or just, I know that the rating system is very flawed because obviously it's like done by a computer. So even if 
to us, the picture is garbage. It could be like a really good photo rating wise, even though I apparently forgot they exist. Oh yeah, I love Fennec Foxes, <laughs> even though I apparently forgot they exist. Nice. Photography ratings and I want open more. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think that's what a lot of people's frustrations were, was that they made this one again on a track and you know, you just have a limited field of view. So, um, and so you, you have to play the levels over and over and over again. So, but yeah, I, I completely understand. And the rating system is very jank sometimes. I, I will say that. I remember that from the N64 version. Okay, so they rate you on pose, size, direction, placement, other Pokemon, and background. Okay, because yeah, I remember in the original, like if you got more Pokemon or you got them doing like an action, things like that, it would, um, it would rate it higher. Okay, so we got one star. I came up with this system to help us understand and categorize how Pokemon behave. Photos of Pokemon in an ordinary state get fewer stars. More unusual behavior means more stars. Simple enough, right? Litten, Rockruff, Grookey, and Totodiles are so cute. Yeah, all of those. My babies. My babies. To be clear, the number of stars a photo receives doesn't affect its score. Every category is important. By the way, the camera keeps logs of what was happening when you took each photo. That data ha helps me categorize your photos. What does that mean? Let's move on to the scoring. First, I'll evaluate the subject's pose. Snapping a photo at just the right moment is the key to getting a high uh, something score. Whatever. Something, yeah. High pose score, there we go. Now onto the other factors. Size is straightforward. The larger your subject Pokemon appears in the photo, the better. Then there's the direction the Pokemon is facing. Try to get it facing you in your photos. And of course, like, I don't know, it, it doesn't really show, but my my baby Bulbasaur forever number one I I also brought um, I'm not wearing it right now because it gets incredibly hot but I brought my Bulbasaur hat it doesn't read very well because of the green screen obviously but when it's on you know it doesn't look too bad okay then there's the direction the Pokemon is facing try to get it facing you in your photos okay next is placement try to get the Pokemon in the center of the frame for a nice balanced photo and finally, you'll get bonus points of other Pokemon in the photo with your subject Pokemon. Now, I know that was a lot of info all at once. Oh, I just, I can't process all that. It's too much. Let me boil it down. Remember this, and you'll do fine. Get the Pokemon nice and big in the center of the frame, then snap the shutter. With all that in mind, here's your evaluation. <gasps> 3,000 points. Ooh, I'm looking good. Hard to believe you're a beginner. Thank you. I assume I can replace these when I get better ones. That picture is garbage, and I hate it. Next is the villain. Is it the villain or Vivillon? I've never really heard it said out loud, so I'm not sure. I'm sure I'm going to mispronounce a lot of these because a lot I haven't heard said out loud. A new addition to our research. It's a garbage picture. Remember getting the whole Pokemon in the frame looking nice and big is key to good size. Okay, well, that was before she taught me how to zoom in, sir. How was it? What did you think? Once you get your photos evaluated, you can use them to fill out your very own Pokemon photo decks. That will be a great milestone to work towards. That about does it. I think it's time you set off on your adventure. Oh, I'm so excited. Now then. That should about do it. See this pod? It'll carry you on your photography expeditions. It reminds me of like, um, what was it? Jurassic World. There we go. With those like round things that they rode around in. By the way. It's called the Neo One. I see. It's the best. It can teleport to far off places in no time flat. Look at them with their teleportation technology. I finally put the finishing touches on it not long ago with a little help from someone I knew. 
You see, it makes use of energy hotspots scattered throughout the lintel region. Mm. One moment, please. Going to shout out. Okay. Come on, Professor. The details can wait. Fair enough. Let's get you moving. Climb on in and touch your camera to the console. Touch your camera to the console. Okay. <clears throat> Ooh, cute. Fancy. I've been obsessed with the way that little misfortune uh, says the word fancy, and I've had it in my head all day long. Lentil travel log, a book chronicling the voyage of Captain Vince to the islands of Lentil around 100 years ago. Can okay, all right. Not bad. Guess we'll figure that out eventually. <clears throat> Let me see if I remember how to do this now. Oh, look at the little Pichu. Look at me. Oh, I forgot. Isn't there... There's a set number of pictures that you have, right? Okay, 67, I think. Okay. <clears throat> My babies. Oh, that's that's too close. <clears throat> Anything in the water? Oh, look at this adorable little derpy bee doof. God, they're so cute. Everything's so cute. And it's so colorful. should have gotten it flying but I think we have to do this like multiple times so I mean like over and over again so whatever that's fine I thought that was fungus <gasps> no oh there's a garbage photo photos left. I know I'm going to miss some things, but... Come on, come on out. <gasps> Look at the little Grookey! Oh, my baby! You chunky babies. Looks like our dog Bruin. What's happening? Is it rest? Oh, it's sleeping. Okay. Oh, yeah. I see what June is saying. The, the, the camera, like the time it takes you to turn around. For some reason, this 10-year-old uh, uh, moves like a 100-year-old man. Oh, what was that? Oh, that was a wormhole. Okay. Hello, baby. I'm like craning my neck upwards like that's going to help me. Oh, what was that? Ooh. Oh. So many things happening. Okay, I've only got 27 photos left. 
Oh. Ooh, look how gorgeous, honey. Work it. Look how cute. I have never seen that Pokemon in my life. Basically, it's the end of the course. Okay. They're gonna eat it? Yeah, probably so. <laughs> they were surrounding it while it slept. I hope you had a good time in Florio Nature Park. Now, just like before, it's time to show me some photos you took. You're gonna meet so many new Pokemon. For real, though. Because, I mean, I've played most of the games, but... There are so many at this point. So, so many Pokemon. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Ugh, these pictures are garbage. Okay, so what does it rate for? Pose, size, action, other Pokemon in the picture. So I guess I'm going to go with this one, even though it's not technically facing me. I mean, there's that one. Hmm. I'm going to submit this one, I think. Yeah. Because it's got another Pokemon in it. It's pretty big. It's centered. It's not looking at me, though. And I don't know if sleeping counts as an action. But... I'm sure we got a better one of this one. We're gonna submit that one. Buffalant. Adorable. Love them. Big babies. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, hold on. Oh, I didn't even see the Grookey in the foreground of that one. Hmm. Let's do... Yeah, we'll do that one. That's fine. And Bidoof. One little chonky buddy. So this one is closer. It's not looking at me, though. This one's doing something, but it's not zoomed in. Hmm. I'm going to submit this one just to see. Molga. Nope. I forget. I keep messing up the... Oh, I did get one of it flying, but it's not centered. Hmm. Let's see. I'm going to submit that one. Oh, yes. Look at the baby. Hmm. See, this one has multiple Pokemon in the picture, but this one is closer, and I think it's looking at me, so I'm going to go with that. Oh, look at those fabulous feet. I guess I'll have to go with that one. Well, I'm sure I have to take it tons of time, so we'll do that. We'll just go with what we got right now. Good God, look at that perfect angel baby right there. I'm very much a grass type lover. I I love the grass types. They're my babies. Oh, is that all we have? That's not even worth submitting, but fine. Hmm. Oh, no, no, no. Ugh, I keep pressing the wrong buttons. Maybe... I guess I'm gonna go with that one, because that's pretty up close. There are multiple Pokemon in the shot, so... I'm gonna go with that. And the last one... is Florges. Ooh. She is a queen. They're a queen. I don't know their gender. They're a queen. Look at that absolute royalty. <gasps> She's stunning. Okay. That's all. Okay.
Oh, it's Dodrio. Oh, Alright. Nice work. Looks like it's fast asleep. Nice work. Keep it up. Yes. Oh, what's the So it's like a little diamond star. Does that mean I don't know what that means. I thought you got like numbers of stars. Maybe? <gasps> hmm. Let's see. Okay, so that's my previous score with that really crappy photo. Watch the really crappy one be better. That'd be hilarious. Okay. Nice. I love how the placement... Okay, look at the placement score. The other really terrible photo got a 930. This one, right up in my face, got a lower score. Gotta love that. Uh, yeah, we'll keep the, the newer photo. Bouffalant. It seems calm. Nice work. Your placement is looking good. Centering your subject balances the photo well. Thank you. So do I have to get, like... I guess I have to keep going back and taking photos until I get a 1 star, a 2 star, a 3 star, and a 4 star for every Pokemon. That seems to be the case. It must be in a hurry. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. Mm, not very good, but okay. Emolga. Such a cutie. Ah, I see. What fascinating behavior. With a bit better timing, this would have been great. It's like, mmm, you tried, but this is trash, so why did you even bring this to me? Oh, two stars on that one. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Got our baby wormhole. Nice Seems like it's on its way somewhere. Nice work. Not bad. Yeah, I'm I'm wondering if they have like a, a section that will show you the different like what the different coloration of stars mean, because there seems to be like a gold one, a diamond one, like a red one. So I need to figure out where that's at. Seems to be swimming. Nice. Pretty good for that one. I didn't think that would get many points. Nice Taylor's a garbage Pokemon, and I, stay I stand by that. Uh, doo -doo -doo. The more Pokemon you get in a photo, the more insight it gives us into the area's ecosystem. Pichu! Okay, while I am not a fan of Pikachu, I will say Pichu is adorable. And the, um, not the Galarian Raichu, what's the, um, Alolan Raichu? Absolutely love the Alolan Raichu. Remember, the closer a Pokemon is to looking directly at the camera, the better you'll score. Yeah, yeah. I'm doing my best over here, okay? Phil! Muesli! What is up, Muesli? How's it going? How are you? I saw that you were streaming today, but I had a very busy day, so unfortunately I could not join. But I hope you are doing well. How are things in your part of the world? Uh, da, 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 and do shout out for our friend Muesli, who is an 
She will say that she's not an expert at Stardew Valley, but she is an expert at Stardew Valley. And she's also teaching me how to play Graveguard Keeper because I'm going to play that here soon on stream. We got our baby Grookey, one of my favorites. Megalito! For each category of one, two, three, or four stars, you can get copper, silver, gold, or diamond. Awesome! Thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Also, hello! How's it going? Uh, Muesli, it's going well. It's been a fun day. Oh, well, I'm glad it was a fun day for someone. Uh, it was a little bit choppy for me, but we're good now. We're here playing some Pokemon. Why is my chat paused? Okay. Galen, a lone Raichu is a tawdry attention seeker. I mean, true, but I think inherently that's the job of the Alolan Pokemon, is to be a Pokemon, but just, like, way more fabulous. So, it is what it is. How's it going, Galen? Thank you so much for hopping in. Going well? Awesome. I am happy that everyone seems to be having a decent night. I'm feeling much better now, and I'm playing this, so I'm super excited. I have wanted to play this for so long. My far away friend, yes. Nice work. Yes, I like, I was obsessed with this game back in the day on, when it was on N64. So I've waited so long for this to come out. Okay, Magikarp. That is a terrible shot. Okay, yeah, that's, that's not good. Let's see, what was it? Copper, silver, gold, or diamond? Okay. Comfy. Nice, nice, nice. The direction could be better. Watch for when it looks right at you, the camera. Okay, how can you tell what its face is? <laughs> it's a ring of flowers. Also, hi, Biebs. What you been up to today, Galen? I assume playing Dead by Daylight while avoiding your actual job and sleep, but that's just a guess. But I hope your Monday went well. And I hope, uh, I assume that since you're here, you did not burn down your kitchen while attempting to make dinner, so. Work and physio, no DVD today. <laughs> Very nice. She, okay, they are a gorgeous Pokemon. I guess that's why their name rhymes with gorgeous. Florgeous. Nice Muesli, uh, what did you get into today that was fun? Did you have your, um, your, your little guy with you? Nothing out of the ordinary here, no. Okay, that was a little pointed, Professor, but okay. I mean, look at that diamond star if it's nothing out of the ordinary. No fires and the food is edible. Double win. Nice. That is, it sounds like a, 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 yeah, like you said, definitely a win. I actually made some, I can't really call it chicken stir fry, but I mean, it was chicken and vegetables stir fried. So I made chicken stir fry and it didn't turn out terribly. I didn't have any rice with it because I'm trying not to eat as many carbs, but um, it was it was passable. It could be better. I need to work on some things. So what did you think? Okay, so I got 44,000 points. Research level two until next level, 65,000. Okay. Huh, I wonder what the research levels do. Like, I, I assume they unlock new areas and you just have to keep playing levels over and over until you get like better scores. One last thing, let me tell you about research levels. Okay, well, here we go. Your research level on a course tells you how much progress you've made there. Once that level goes up, you may see Pokemon behave in ways you haven't seen before. Oh, interesting, okay. The key to raising your research level is to observe all types of Pokemon's behaviors. That means getting photographs of them in every category from one star to four stars. So in short, fill up that photo decks, keep that in mind and you'll be on the right track. So get out there and snap lots of photos and cherish the encounters with Pokemon you have along the way. Yay! All right. Another step forward for our research. I bet Pokemon in the area are getting comfortable with you. <gasps> I got a present! 
You got a research title. Photo program newbie. <laughs> Alright. You research Florio Nature Park for the first time. <gasps> there are achievements in this game? You got a research title. Look this way. You got a score of a thousand points or more in the direction category during a photo evaluation. Smack dab in the middle. You got a score of a thousand points or more in the placement category during a photo evaluation. Nice. Um, save photos album. Save the photos you took to your album. I mean, does it not automatically do that? Uh, oh, the sass in that moment, Torn. She snaps her fingers in his E formation. I mean, <laughs> yeah, like he wasn't. He was a little rude when he. We're not gonna. We, we're not gonna fight with the professor our first day, but. I will disagree with him there. Filth, I found out the name of my grandchild to be, and we made a box for um, for Den and eat pizza. Made a box for Den. I'm not sure what you mean by that one, but that's awesome that you found out the name of your grandchild to be. Um, recently, uh, my brother, um, my brother is expecting a, his first child, and so we're super excited, and we learned the name recently. And um, my sister-in-law, she is going to be having a baby in like, I think next month. Yeah, next month. Um, and they still haven't picked a name yet. <laughs> so we're anxious to find out what that's going to be. I didn't play much of this game, but found it surprisingly grindy. Uncles torn in there. Oh, yeah. Well, we're already uncles. Um, we have one nephew. He's going to be turning 11 next weekend. Um, you know, he's chill. We, we get along with him. Uh, Seedly Fox, hello, hello, welcome. What's up? After your research trips, you can choose photos to save your to your album, which is in your space in the lab. You can also choose Resnap to make some changes. Oh, cute. Okay, cute, cute, cute. I hope it's Little Griselda. Yeah, we're hoping that they name it Griselda. That's one of the names that they're really heavily considering, and we're gonna call it Baby Grizzly. Uh. Da, 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 da. Seely Fox. Y'all should follow Seely Fox. I saw them uh, playing Sea of Thieves earlier today, and unfortunately, I was not able to join the stream because, like I said, very busy day. But they are a lovely streamer, so please give them a follow. Okay, so we have to decide which ones we want to save. Baby Grizzly, that's so cute. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean. Griselda is definitely not a name I'm thrilled with, but, you know, it's not my child, so whatever. Uh, we made a box for... Oh, cool! That's awesome. That sounds like fun. I haven't done that in so long. Uh, none of the... Oh, well, I'm gonna keep that one. I will keep that. How do I back out? Okay. And then... I think I can get better ones. I'm gonna save... This... No this one but I think I can get better ones of most of these and even though the professor said this one is garbage I I'm gonna save this one mm -mm -mm -mm. let's see I bet you and nerd candy are great at being uncles um you know we try to be fun uncles but yes uh, like Nerd Candy said, uh, we like to bully him as well. Because, <laughs> yes, you know, he was super cute when he was younger. But kids today, they get so sassy. It's like they turn into teenagers before they're teenagers. And uh, so, yeah, sometimes you just got to bully him. <laughs> so, bullying is basically in the uncle job description. Yeah, exactly. I mean, yes, he may have cried a time or 10 or 20, but, you know, toughens him up a little bit. <laughs> Look at my baby Grookey. I think I can get better ones, but I'm, I'm going to go ahead and save it anyway. I love that Grookey. I want to, like, adopt it and bring it home with me. Um... Alright, and I know that the professor said that this is basic, but... They are stunning, and I want to save that photo. Okay, so how do I back out of here? Hopefully they're saved. Return to camp. 
Knock him down a peg. Yeah, exactly. Because, yeah, like, woo. Like, even at a, like, I think by the time he was, like, six or so, he was already getting, like, a really sassy mouth. Like, he would come back with things, and I'm like, how do you even know what that means? Like, I was insulted sometimes. I was like, what? That's what uncles do. I play uh, all kinds of pranks on my Jess and Harrison. <laughs> Very nice. Well, good. I, I'm glad we're not the only ones who pick on our nephews and nieces. <laughs> Don't be a dick, Grace. Yes, exactly. I call my niece out. I really see her, so she actually listens to me. Nice. Yeah, usually he has learned that me and Hasiel, we are serious. Because, like, uh, that just about covers everything. Um... When he comes over, like, during the summers, a lot of times, like, he'll stay with us during the day, like, while his mom is working. Or, uh, you know, he'll come over and spend the night sometime. Yeah, we we are not joking. When we say to do something, we mean to do something. <laughs> so, he usually listens to us pretty well. Can we go on a nighttime photo shoot later? Ooh, that sounds fun. Not yet, but soon. After a little more practice. Also. By the way, don't forget, you can come back to the lab and take a look at your photo decks anytime. Okay. I'll explain more about that when you stop by the lab. Anyway. Well, don't let me keep you any longer. Go have a good time and snap some photos. That's the name of my new grandbaby to be. Well, uh, Ellie Grace. Ooh, that's a pretty name. I like that name. Very cool. Well, I'm excited that you're going to have a new grandbaby. That is adorable. I, you know, back in the day, I, before our, our nephew, JJ, um, I was not much of a fan of children, but he kind of changed that for me, and so I'm very much looking forward to the new niece and the new nephew. So, so do I click? Okay, settings, lab, research. Okay, I guess let's go back to the lab. She wanted to talk to us some more. Yeah. My niece, uh, my niece is Grace Elizabeth. Ooh, nice, interesting. <laughs> That's very similar. Then, I love the names that start with E. My nieces are all good little Christian Catholic girls, and so they are super well behaved with me. They have a healthy fear of their pagan witch uncle. <laughs> nice. I love it. I'm surprised the parents let you uh, go around them. Because, like, I know with our nephew, I was mentioning last night on stream, I think his father is uh, very heavily Jehovah's Witness. Um, so, yeah, like, no holidays, no birthdays, things like that. Um, but, you know, we've, we've helped corrupt him, I guess, uh, you know. <laughs> Not that it's your first time here, of course. This is where the professor does his research and works on mechanical stuff. In fact, he pretty much lives here. All right. Anyway, let me give you a quick rundown of what you can do here. Okay. That server over there is where we store our research work. There are a few things you can do with all that data. First, first you can check your photo decks. Okay. So that shows me how many, like, which star levels I need to get. Oh my god, that's so freaking cute. All the things happening in the background. Um, okay, so that'll let me look at those. That's the encyclopedic record you're building with the photos you're taking. Okay. Isn't it cool getting to put... Can we speed up this text? Isn't it cool getting to put together your very own photo decks? Next, there's your space. Your space, really. That's where you can see your personal photo album and adventure milestones. By the way. Your album is for photos you want to keep but not put in your photo decks. <laughs> you can edit your album photos in some cool ways too. Okay, I've seen some of these like photo edits and they are hilarious and adorable, so I am looking forward to that. Am I forgetting anything? Professor. Hey professor, was there anything else I was supposed to mention? Did you cover what we can do on the internet? Oh. The internet, eh? Oh yeah, that was it. If you use the online internet feature, you can see photos from players all around the world. If you really like a photo, you can tell the photographer nice job by giving the photo a little digital medal. <laughs> They're called sweet medals. Okay, that's weird. Give all you want. People love getting them. That's right, you can also see other photographers' rankings in each score category. Okay. Alright, I think that's everything. I'm sure you'll figure it all out quick. All right. Don't be shy, try everything out. Audinos are so cute. They really are. Like, she's, well, 
I keep saying she. I keep forgetting, you know, I... <laughs> now that you can have, you know, the breeding and everything, you never really know um, what gender of Pokemon you're looking at, so... But I just say she. But Audino is adorable. My dad is Roman Catholic. My mom is old school Irish witch. Ooh, wow. Wow. What a pair. <laughs> They let my sisters and I decide what we wanted to do. I picked the witchy side. My older sister chose the monotheistic approach. Uh, my younger sister, I don't even know what she's got going on. It's a mess. I just tried to steer clear. <laughs> oh, no. Well, you know, that's incredible that they allowed you all to pick your own paths. Because if we ever have kids, that's kind of what I want to do. Because, like, I've got my stuff that I believe, and Hasiel's got his stuff that he believes, and, you know... Just try to be good people, you know, is the main thing. Uh, okay. Let me move up my, um, my head a little bit. I feel like I'm kind of in the way of something. Oh, okay, just check your photo decks. Because I know I'm going to be taking pictures, so I'm, I feel like I'm going to be in the way anywhere. Um, what is this? Your space. Sorry to do all this beginning stuff. I probably should have done all this, like, beginner, like, intro training stuff out of the way before I got on here, but... Research titles, okay. I'll present you with various research titles as you progress through our survey. Check here to see what's possible to get and your progress on each one. Okay. I mean, hold on. Okay. What else did I need to see here? Oh, it just goes to all the different... Okay. Am I supposed to click on those or something? Like, my achievements? Hold on, let me... Yeah, I'm not sure why it keeps showing the exclamation mark like there's something that I haven't done. Hmm. Whatever. Oh. Woo! Muesli! Thank you for the host. I appreciate it very much. Also, once again, y'all let me know if you heard the audio for that alert. Um, I'm assuming you didn't because one night it worked, one night it didn't, and now's the third night, and I'm assuming it's probably not working. But y'all let me know. Okay, it went away that time. I heard it. Oh, nice. So it's actually, it, it chose to work tonight. Okay. I cannot figure out what is going on with our stream labs because, like, I think Saturday night it worked, Sunday night it didn't work, and tonight it's working again. And I, I didn't change a single thing the song of the angels <laughs> beautiful well it'd probably be better than this repetitive music uh let's see okay photo decks a young girl who loves pokemon and helps professor mirror as oh it, wow it really you gotta be a speed reader apparently all right um pokemon show me a photo of a pokemon to make a page for it on that page you can move your pointer movements and here it's cry I wonder if they still have the old school, like, digital sounding, like, weird cries. If you discover it has other forms, you'll be able to see those here too. Yeah, let's see. Caption. I don't want to upload it. How do I do the, um, how do I hear its cry? I wasn't paying attention. Oh, there we go. Look how cute. Okay, okay. That's adorable. It's like a lay. That's so cute. Yeah, like uh, Nerd Candy was saying earlier, you know, at this point, there's like a thousand Pokemon, and some I have not run, in, run across in my gameplay. So some of these are new to me. Okay. Let's look at the map. I don't know any Pokemon beyond Gen 3, but whatever that little hamster Pokemon on the desk is, it's cute. Yes. I was trying, I was looking at it and trying to remember its name. Um, 
I can't. Like, all of the, like, Pikachu knockoffs are... They all kind of run together for me. But it is one of the cuter ones. Heart you turn... Uh, heart you torn. Need to drop a lurk. I will leave the stream running to still count as a viewer. Oh, well, thank you, Musically. I appreciate that. Have a lovely evening. I'm glad you had a wonderful day. And I hope it continues to go well. Thank you, as always, for stopping by. Y'all should follow Musely if you're not following her. Plays a lot of Stardew Valley and sometimes Cozy Grove. And uh, lately has been playing Graveyard Keeper, which I cannot wait to play. Here you can view information about courses you've researched. Pokemon and objects of interest are marked on the map, so you can look back on your trips. Okay. Florio Nature Park. In this lush green park, see Pokemon up close in the natural habitat. Okay, so that's the only one we've unlocked so far, I guess. Because I think we have to, like, bump up our rating before we can go elsewhere. I think. Maybe. Hmm. Oh, I guess we have to click on it. Park tip. Oh, okay. This course runs uh, along a large lake and through a field of colorful flowers. Pokemon are a regular sight here, which makes it an ideal location for young, up-and-coming photographers. Okay. Alright, so this kind of like lets you kind of plan out like where things, where to expect some things. Oh, you can see even closer. Oh, nice. Okay, this is pretty detailed then. <clears throat> okay. And I'm sure I've probably missed some because like it takes forever to turn around. Um, so yeah. You know, obviously replaying these will allow me to get used to where the various Pokemon are. Because, like, I know, like, in this section there were more Bidoof. Okay. Look at my baby. Okay, and you can see the picture you took there. Neat. What am I supposed to do here? Let's see. Am I supposed to click on all these? I'm not going to click on all these. Okay. God, look how precious it is. Look at that little baby. Oh my goodness. Oh, I just want to squeeze it. Nothing should be that cute. Oh, perfect angel baby. I love him so much. Okay, let's get back to taking pictures. Thank you for the biddies, my love. Did you hear that? Because I heard it. It was very loud in my headphones. But it might have been so loud in my headphones that it went through into the microphone. Nope. Oh, okay. So it didn't come through. Great. Super. We'll test one more just to see. Uh, let me do a follow. I will be in and out for the next little bit, but always lurking. I gotta go throw some red, green, and blue Koopa shells at my fiance and our friends. Remind them that their place is not on the winner's podium. <laughs> nice. Well, have fun. Enjoy that. It's always nice to uh, destroy friendships and, and you know, various relationships with your loved ones uh, by playing that game. Good luck. Although it sounds like you don't need it. No. Okay. Well, I don't know, my love. I, I can't figure it out. June said June and Apple Glass have volunteered to try to help me with some things, so maybe we can get it figured out here soon. Maybe on Wednesday I can try uh, see if one of them might be available. Okay, so how do I um, how do I just like 
Okay, research camp. There we go. Right. Uh, there's just not a good place for this webcam. Teach them pain. <laughs> Make them fear you. Let's head out to the nature park and take some photos. Okay, let's try to take some better ones this time. You headed out on another expedition already? No. Yes. Before you go, let me tell you one more thing you can do with your research camera. You can run a scan. Excuse me, gross. That'll give you details about your surroundings. It tells you about nearby Pokemon and points out anything unusual. Hey, so... Professor, what counts as unusual? You've never given me a solid answer. No. Basically, anything that makes the system go, check this out. Well, I guess that's all the detail we're going to get. Yep. You'll get the hang of it once you try it. Rita, would you mind demonstrating? Yep. Leave it to me, Professor. All right, get that camera ready. Hmm, okay. Tutorial? Okay, yes. Running a scan is easy. All you gotta do is press the X button. X. Mm-hmm. And did you also notice that question mark? Yes. That tells you there's something to take a closer look at. First, move the pointer over the question mark. Did you see the pointer change shape? Mm-hmm. That's your cue to press and hold the X button to analyze whatever's there. I'm not gonna remember this. There! Now you can see this the is The Neo one, your this vehicle is essential okay. Interesting. Come to think of it, I heard that a friend of the professor came up with the name Neo One. Well, pretty easy, right? When this icon pops up at the bottom of your screen, there's something nearby to check out. What icon? Oh, okay. Oh, that icon. That one. Okay. When you see that, try running a scan and taking a careful look around. Oh, right. I almost well, maybe if I turned a little bit faster, I would be into that. Oh, right. I almost forgot. One more cool thing you should know about scanning. Some Pokemon will react to the sound and electrical signal from the scan. Hmm. If it gets their attention, it's your chance to snap a photo. Oh, cool. Okay. Okay. So it pierces their eardrums and catches their attention. Gotcha. Explanation's all done. Thank you. I really wonder what was behind their decision to, like, have them just throw in random words on this screen and then during the tutorial, like, actually read things out. I don't know. That's weird. It seems like it should be, like, an all or nothing, no, all or nothing type thing. Don't hesitate to run a scan. It'll tell you a lot about your surroundings. Kind of research expedition... Yes, let's do that. Let us be on our way. And we'll try out the scanny thing. I won't be as concerned with trying to see everything this time. I just want to test out the, the scan features and things like that. So. Wait. Oh, okay, yes. That's the course that I want. Yes. Okay, so right now, all I can do is this part during the daytime until I can unlock, I assume, the nighttime, maybe? Goodness. Oh, I messed that up. Okay. Next time I'll know. Ugh, I messed that up. Ugh. Terrible. 
Okay, I'm gonna try to get more peaks like in the water and in the trees this time. Oh, bollocks. Ooh. Oh, X. What? Okay, okay. Some charred fruits on the ground. Did a Pokemon do this? I don't know if I'm supposed to take a picture of it or not. Oh. A Krista Bloom that grows on Florio Island. Okay. Alright, take a picture of it? Uh, whatever. the baby. Oh my goodness. Look at it. It looks just like our baby. Oh. I love it so much. Where's that stupid derpy magic art? Oh. What? Oh, what, what? Oh. This fruit grows in lentil. Okay. I, I don't. I don't know if I'm supposed to. Maybe try. It. Oh. I mean. Okay. Oh. Hoot hoot. Ooh! It's definitely not a good picture. Okay. But at least I know it's there now. Gracious. Almost done. Oh, okay. We're almost at the end of the... Uh... Oh, look at it with its flowers. Oh, it's so cute. Okay, so we saw, we found a few new things. I'm guessing they'll maybe explain more about, like, the the seeds and the fruit and the flower that we saw. <clears throat> Welcome back. <clears throat> okay, so we got better bouffalant pictures that time, I think. I think that's adorable. It's not the clearest photo, but I'm going to submit it because I think it's cute. Vivian. Mm, I think we're still okay with what we had. Maybe. Hmm. I think he rates them, and if one is lower, you can keep the previous one, I think. We'll see. Hmm. These are both terrible, but okay. I think we're gonna go with that. Mm -mm. We're gonna go with this one. 
And ducklet. Oh, ducklet's so cute. I know it's just like a basic blue duck, but still adorable. Okay, this one has two, and it's fairly centered. So we're going to go with that. And... I know this picture that we got of Hoot Hoot is trash, but, you know, it's better than nothing. It'll register it. We've got to figure out how to make it turn around, though. I mean, it's daytime, though, so, you know, it's, you know, probably not going to turn around. Look how, like, I wish I could put up a picture of our Chow Chow, because legit looks just like him. Not going to lie. God, he's so precious. Did I not get a better picture? I guess not. Hmm. Oh, I already chose that one. Okay. So, comfy. I think I got its face, right? Not there, but maybe there? It's hard to tell. I mean, I know that that lump is the the body, but hmm, kind of hard to tell. We'll see. I'm gonna submit that one. Okay, let's show the professor. You haven't selected a. F oh, hold on. No. Okay. Oh, okay. We'll choose that one, and none of these were good. Hmm. I don't know, I guess we'll... Just to submit something, I guess. No subject. Oh! Okay, so... We didn't need to take a picture of these. It was just, like, showing us with a scan. I hope they give us a little bit more information, though, because, like, it, I mean, I know there was the fruit, the flower. Oh, no, no, no. Those were the seeds. That was the flower. And then there was some kind of fruit. Thank you for the lurk, Sil. I appreciate it. Hope you're doing well. Okay. Show Professor. Let's see what we've got. Ooh, it's a bouffalant. It's a two-star photo. That's new. Nice work. I don't understand the star ratings yet. Like, the number of stars. Yeah, I don't understand exactly how that is determined. That flower is an excellent look. Yes, nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. Yeah, that's what I was going for. Them flowers. Gotta have that flower crown. Just like in Pokemon Go. The more Pokemon you get in a photo, the more insight it gives us into the area's ecosystem. Cool. Okay. Is that a new high score? Maybe? Ooh. That's a very pretty photo. I like that. So colorful. Vivion. Okay. Next is Vivi Vivion. What a beautiful Pokemon. Hmm. So not... Not better. Uh, we'll keep the previous one. Florges. Mm -mm -mm -mm. This is fairly common behavior. Great timing. This is well taken. Okay, so... Still not the best. Well, clearly. Okay. Yeah, we'll go with that one still. And I know this one, definitely. I could have sworn I took a different one of him climbing up the tree, but I think that's when she was telling me to scan something, so I think I got distracted. Nice work. Terrible. Okay. No, we'll stick with that one. Takes my breath away. Okay. Yes. Good. We at least did better on that one. Don't 
Couplet. Okay, that's not terrible. Silver Star. Bidoof, my favorite. And look, I want to print out that picture and keep it forever. And I want to put it right next to a picture of our Chow Chow. I love it so much. Looks curious. What about, I wonder? Oh, yes. Two diamond stars. The Pokemon you photographed came out nice and big. Well done. Yes. Metacarp. Okay, this is definitely not going to be better. Oh, okay. So, this tiny, insignificant fraction of a Magikarp that you see there is apparently better. Okay. Sure. It's got the higher score, so we'll go with that. Whatever you say, Professor. First time you've gotten it as your subject, yes. This is trash. Nice work. Yes. Look at that. All right, all right. Isn't it adorable? Oh, sweet. Oh. Okay, sweet. Yeah, we did really well there. We went up to a diamond star. Uh, we'll go with that one. That's a better picture. Awesome. Wait, expedition point. Oh, okay, I was like, why is it zero? <laughs> what have I done to offend you? If we make a few more discoveries, we may reach some new frontiers. Okay. So I guess we've got to play through it a few times because I'm still, like, I'm certain there's still Pokemon that we have overlooked and I need to scan some more stuff and get a few better pictures and then maybe it'll unlock the night version of this map, I'm assuming, hopefully. You've got a score of 2,000, poor, 2000 points or more in the size category, okay? By the way, thanks to the progress you've made in your research, I've got something to report. I'll fill you in once your photos are squared away. I think you'll be pleased to hear this. I really wish they would speed up that dialogue a little bit. Save photos to album. Okay, I definitely want to save that picture of Bidoof. I kind of like that one too, but it's nothing special. Yeah. And I know that one is closer, but I like this one better because it's got the grass in the background and stuff. And I also like the little derpy sitting here one. So I'm gonna save that. Yes, I'm gonna save that. And I also wanna save this one. Crystals and cats. Welcome, Rachel. How are you? What's shaking? I know it's been uh, only a couple of hours since I've seen you, but I hope you're still doing well. I'm gonna save this one. All right. I guess this one's nothing spectacular, but I'm going to go ahead and save it anyway. I don't know how many you can save, but I want to try to get a p better picture of this bouffalant wearing the little uh, flower crown because that's adorable. Okay, I think that's all I want to save. I hope it's saving those. Return to camp. Cleaning and doing laundry. Uh, how are you? How was your day? Day was a little rough, but uh, you know, every day can't be fantastic. But we're here now and we're playing a fun game. It's bright and colorful and happy and I'm chill. So we're good. Hello. And I'm not working tonight, so there's that. Your, blah. your photography seems to be going well. I think you're about ready for a nighttime visit. Ooh, I unlocked the nighttime version. Yes. Okay. 
<gasps> Look at that little Caterpie. Hopefully you'll get to see one of Lintel's greatest wonders, a glow called the Illumina Phenomenon. The Illuminati Phenomenon? Phenomenon? You're the one who discovered how that glow happens, right, Professor? Yes, I am, but explaining the process scientifically was just one step toward my ultimate goal. Finding the special Pokemon spoken of in Legends of Lintel. You mean the Illumina Pokemon? I thought they were made up. No, they're very real. You've seen the photos from Captain Vince's travelog, haven't you? What? Apparently they like to go into uh, thick fogs and out-of-focus areas, like Bigfoot. You can barely tell what's in those photos, and they're ancient anyway, literally a hundred years old. All right, now. Well, we can discuss that later. Right. For now, enjoy your nighttime outing. Okay, let's... Do, I want to do one more daytime, and then we'll do a nighttime. Because I'm assuming at night there's going to be, like, Hoot Hoot is going to be more active and things like that. So, um, so yeah, I definitely want to do a nighttime. Okay, I don't want to do the night just yet. And I assume the course doesn't change at night. I assume it stays the same course. Good night, my love. I love you. Okay, I gotta be prepared for this. This. Is that gonna come out? Oh, I only got Pichu. Fine. I want to keep an eye on the skies, because I know that Emolga is going to be flying by at some point. I need to be more prepared for that. Oh, look at it! Oh, it had a stick. Oh, there it goes. Ah, oh, I missed it again. I've got to be more prepared. Ooh, it looks sour. What do I need to scan? Show me, show me the thing. Wait, is this the same thing? Can you guess which Pokemon did this? Huh. I don't understand why it's getting me to scan some of the same things. Does it just always do that for this map? try to get Magikarp from here. I need to look behind me. I don't want to... I feel like I'm missing stuff. Oh, that was Taylor. Gross. Who cares? <gasps> look at my baby! Come back, child. I didn't get any new pictures of Grookey. It's okay, though. Yeah, I feel like it's kind of weird that it has me scan some of the same stuff over and over. But I guess that... Ooh! Ooh, look at that! Work it, honey. Work it. Make love to the camera. You're doing great. <gasps> There's a really close picture of Magikarp. Yes! Okay. I feel a little bit better about that one. Oh, there's Hoot Hoot. But we're gonna, we're gonna get pe better pictures of that one at night. <clears throat> he doesn't want to come out during the daytime. 
What's back there? Okay, wormhole. I know there's gotta be some stuff like hidden in the trees. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. I have fat fingers, I tend to press a lot of things at the same time, so. No, don't fly away from me. It's time. Is there anything in the distance I'm missing? Hmm. Oh, look at that baby. No, don't take me yet. Uh, whatever. It's fine. We got, uh, not Tangela, but Tangela Growth. Um, and we got a better picture of Magikarp. I think I got a better picture of Pichu interacting with, uh, Grookey. So maybe? <gasps> June Gloom, hello. Oh, yes. We love the Pokemans. We love to see it. How are you, Junathan Gloom? Hope you're doing good. Okay. Surely this picture of Pichu is better than the ones I've taken before. Buffalant. Um, I think this one is better, so we'll see. Um, this one, it's hanging out, doing its little thing. Molga. Oh, there's not even a point to, like, submit that. But I guess we have to? I don't know. I don't know how that works. Yeah, I don't think any of these are really necessarily better, except maybe the Magikarp, the Pichu, the Buffalant is a little bit closer. Mm, let's go for this one. How are you? I am doing better now that we're playing Pokemon and chilling out. Things are quietening down. And I'm not at work, so I'm happy. And I'm still just like shook that, not to rub it <laughs> in your face, um, because I, I know you're chill with it, but I'm not used to winning things, so winning that on uh, winning RPGs uh, giveaway. <gasps> I was so excited. Mm, let's do... Let me see if I have anything better. I feel like this one is more direct, maybe? I don't know, they're both pretty terrible. We'll go with that. Did you end up having to, uh to lose it on, um, who did you say? Like the accounting department? Not the accounting department, fiscal. Look how grumpy it looks. Oh yes. And we got tan growth. Tang growth. Tang growth. All right, these are all essentially the same. I wonder if like, see in this case, I don't know if, cause this is, I think objectively a better picture but I'm wondering if it's gonna want one that's like right up close, like that. I'm gonna say this one, just because it's closer, but if not, we can try again the next time, uh, submitting one of the more further away pictures. And there's no point to submit that, but we'll go ahead. Uh, also, I don't know if you're still here, June, but if you are, do you always like, do you always have to submit a picture? I don't think you do. I'm gonna try I'm gonna try not doing one for comfy. You haven't selected photos from every folder. Is this what Yes, okay, so okay, it's fine. Never mind then. Ryan, what is up, friend? How are things? How is your Monday? What you been up to today? Time to check these photos. Oh, it's Pichu. It's a two-star photo. That's new. Okay. Nice work. So we got a two-star. Yeah, 
Yes, two silver stars. Okay, we'll take it. Your subject's dead center, so it all feels balanced. Sweet. Buffalant. Next is Buffalant. It seems full of vigor. Nice. Okay. We really jumped up on that one. Got a diamond star. Um, I still like this picture better. Because it's got, like, Garuki down here looking at him. There's two of them. But there's also the Dodrio beak in the, the foreground. So um, we'll go with this one. Doing good now? Yeah, same. Yeah, bit of a rough day, but doing better now. So I'm glad it's the same for you. Next is Bidoof. What a cute Pokemon. Looks like it's busy building a lodge. Perfect timing. You did wonderfully. Awesome. Oh, nice. So that one's better. Sweet. Uh, we'll go with that one. Oh. <laughs> well, at least that got us a one star. I've got to be better with the timing on that one. So that one went down in quality, which, you know, not surprising. Mm -mm. Nice work. We had... Oh! Lady Demetresk! Lady Domitresk, excuse me. How's it going? Thank you for uh, following. Much appreciated. Hope you're doing well. The more Pokemon you get in a photo... Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Um, We'll go with the previous one. Next we've got Wormpole. Okay. Yes, we did better. Okay. Nice. We upgraded to a diamond star. Doing great. Awesome. Doing anything fun this Monday evening? Um Okay, we'll go with that one. This has to be better. Like it has to be. <laughs> Okay, sweet. Mm, yeah, we'll go with that one. Okay, there we go. Taylor. Nice work. Oh, wow. Okay, so we jumped up. Even though that one's not centered. Okay. The better you center your Pokemon. Okay. Uh, this one's still cuter, but you can see how grumpy he is in this one, so we're, we'll go with that one. A new discovery. This is Tangrowth. This is the first time you've gotten it as your subject. Nice work. Okay. The Pokemon you photographed came out nice and big. Alright. I'm going to try next time through... Um, getting it from further away and see if that does anything. Well, we got a diamond star on that one, so. Makes me happy. And now we get to do a nighttime uh, run through. Next is Hoot Hoot, it exudes a strange charm. Looks like it's fast asleep. <laughs> this probably won't change at all, so yeah. No. We did a few points better, so sure, we'll take it. For now, because I'm assuming on the night run we'll Get a better shot. Do, 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 do. Okay, so I'm thinking with maybe like two runs of the night, uh, the night version, that maybe we'll get to level three, hopefully. Perseverance is a key ingredient of research. You'll have, uh, wait, you'll have my help every step of the way. Uh, let's see if there's anything worth saving. Mm, this one is kind of cute. I feel like it can be better, but we're going to save it anyway. Mm, kind of like that. So we're going to save that. 
I think these are mainly for sa saving like really unique, like cutesy things that you capture. But uh, I'm gonna go ahead and save stuff, and I can always delete it later, I guess. Yeah. Uh, I feel like I like this one better. Okay, I'm off. Have a great night. Thank you so much for hanging out. I appreciate it. Uh, it's always lovely to see you. I appreciate... You. Well, I've already said I appreciate you being here. But yes, thank you for your help earlier uh, explaining the stars. Thank you, thank you. Have a wonderful night. Sleep well. Pleasant dreams. I hope your Tuesday goes well. I hope these are saving. I'm not really sure. I need to go and actually check at the computer. But, uh, return to camp. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Big ol' head's in the way again. Because of course it is. Hey, let's go for a nighttime photo shoot at the nature park. Okay, we are gonna do that. But, I'm gonna go get some more tea. And maybe more coffee. I don't know. We'll see. But I have to go pee. So I'm going uh, I'm to put up the Be Right Back screen. So y'all hang tight for just a moment. And listen to some musics. Ooh. It's loud. All right. Be right back, y'all.
Alrighty, we are back. One moment. Alrighty, that music. Oop! Oh, excuse me, my phone was on. Alright, uh, my mic is going, game audio is going, we should be good. We're good. Alright, so let's do the nighttime version of this. I'm super excited to do the nighttime version, or the nighttime ride through. Welcome back. Thank you, Ryan. Okay. After each expedition... Okay. You can make last minute changes with the resnap function, too. Thank you, June. Y'all up to anything interesting this evening? Playing any DVD or any cool games? I'm glad I'm... Pl I, like, I'm kind of glad that chat voted on this because like I've been wanting to play it for like I think we've had it for almost a week but I just haven't had the time to play so I am happy that I'm getting to play it now no nothing fun just hanging out <laughs> it's so bright Ooh. Oh, I'm excited. <gasps> Look at that adorable skin. Oh, come back. Oh, the Tangrowth is like out wandering. Okay. Look at the big babies. So cute. Oh, 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 oh. Where's it at? Where's it at? Oh, catch it. Catch it. Oh, lame. Okay, where is that hoot hoot? How can I make the Tangrowth turn around? Oh, wait. Murkrow. Okay, we're gonna try to get closer to that. Hmm. I don't know how to make it turn around. Yes. Make love to the camera. Oh. Oh. Okay. Noises are coming up from the unnatural bump in the ground. Okay. Someone's sleeping there. <gasps> Woo! Pincer, okay. How do we make it come out, though? Crystal blue, okay. It's giving off a blue glow. They sleep. <gasps> ah! <gasps> My babies! <laughs> oh my god. Look at them, they're so perfect. <sighs> my babies. Ah, oh, I'm gonna use all my, my film on them. Oh my god. Ooh, okay. Got hoot hoot. I guess we'll get a closer picture later. Oh, damn it. Alright, obviously we're gonna have to, like, replay. Oh my god, look how cute. Uh, uh, my heart. My heart. I can't. I'm overwhelmed right now. Oh, oh, we forgot who, who, or was that the, oh yeah, there it is. Oh, yeah, we, we messed that up. I was too enamored with the other things going on. Oh, there's one. We can get closer. <gasps> is that a combi? Oh, look at the combis! I want to see their faces, though. 
That would have been a cool shot. Oh my god, look at all the combies. <gasps> Turn around, baby. <gasps> oh, okay. Krista, why does it keep showing me that? Is there some way to like activate them? Okay. Oh, I didn't get any good shots of like any of the combies. I was the only one that voted for Muta's Ion, but you know, if this brings you happiness. <laughs> Finally started Snap. Yes, I'm so excited. I am enjoying it so far. But I was kind of bummed because I did want to finish up Muta's Ion. Um, because I like it. I know it's not everybody's cup of tea, but I'm enjoying it. And I want to go ahead and finish it up. That way we can start something new. So, I mean, we're already starting something new. But um, I'm not sure what I'm going to play yet. Um, I haven't really decided. Because I'm going to take a break from The Walking Dead for a little bit. Because that's just too, too intense for me. Like, it's a lot of emotion. So I'm going to try to figure out something else to play. Uh, first, let's get your photos evaluated. Okay. Hello, RP Genius, and thank you again so much for the giveaway earlier on your stream. I am so excited that I won something. Stole it right out from under June. How was the... Okay, so my doggo is barking to be let in. I'll be right back. I'm sorry. I'm not going to put up a VR back screen. It'll just take me a sec. I apologize. Sorry, guys. Sorry about that, y'all. Ding. All right. Of course, I'm glad you won. Yay! I'm so excited. Ah, oh, makes me happy. Um. Okay. So even though now I have to give you my address, and I don't know how I feel about that. You seem kind of sketch. So no, I'm just kidding. Um. Should I submit the one of it running? Because it's not looking at the camera and it's not centered. But this one is just kind of standing there. We'll see. Ooh, shit. <laughs> it's a Nancy Drew thing. Hello. Hello, Raiders. How is it going? Welcome, y'all. Uh, wow. I am so sorry. Uh, I don't think my audio is working on my alerts to you all, but it blasted in my eardrums, so that definitely woke me up, so thank you for that. <laughs> um, if any of my uh, my folks in here, any of my lurkers are not following It's a Nancy Drew thing, please, please, please drop her a follow. She's lovely. Her community is lovely. Uh, she plays a lot of cool games, usually a lot of Switch stuff. Um, uh, she's been playing uh, Breath of the Wild lately, and I know I've seen her play a lot of Animal Crossing. I feel like some Mario Kart, things like that very sweet person so please 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 drop them a follow how's it going uh i am doing well we're having fun i this is my first time playing snap uh we just finally got a copy like last week and i was obsessed with this game when i was a kid so i'm so excited to play this as an adult <laughs> raid from nancy's arcade i love that that's so cute thank you so much raiders welcome uh my name is torn uh, this is Them Filth Goblins. My husband is the other goblin. His name is Nerd Candy, and he streams on different nights than I stream. Occasionally, we'll do co-op streams. We have a few games that we've got lined up that we want to play together. Um, so yeah, we play a pretty big variety of things. I usually stick to, like, chill, like, um, 
Nintendo type games, like happier, more upbeat games like this. And he plays uh, more intense things like Detroit and um, Conan Exiles and No Man's Sky and things like that. So I'm excited. It looks awesome. Yes. Have you? Are you a big Pokemon fan? Um, like, have you played? I've been. I've been into Pokemon ever since uh, they. Um, it premiered in America, so I've been watching the show and playing the games ever since I was a little kid. So, No Man's Sky, I love that game too. Yeah, it is such a cool game, and like, I know a lot of people were really bummed out when it first came out, uh, but they've made so many improvements over the years that it is a really incredible game at this point. I love survival crafting games, and that's one of his favorite. Mad Lad Liam, how's it going? Just popping in. If you have a PS5, I have a game you think you may like. Unfortunately, um, I'm poor. We don't have a <laughs> PlayStation 5 yet. Um, but eventually, we will get one. What is the game that you think that I might like? Yeah, I am. I love Pokemon. Uh, same, since I was a kid too. Very nice. Yes, I... Then, I'm sure you will probably love this game. Again, I'm just starting it out. I know it gets repetitive, but that's the whole point of Pokemon Snap, is to just do the same things and try to get better pictures. Uh, wait, wait, oh, no, 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 I don't wanna submit that. No, 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 no. Um, but yes, welcome, welcome, Raiders. Uh, also, hello, you are locking, awesome. <laughs> well, I appreciate that, I'm not really, but thank you for, for lying to me. Soothe me with sweet, sweet lies. How's it going, Mad Lad Liam? Should I submit the picture of it flying or the picture where it's like more centered? I'm gonna go with the, the flying picture just because it's an action. It's Hoth in here. I absolutely love that name. I feel like I've, I've mentioned that to you in in uh, Nancy Drew's um, chat before, but if not, I really love that name. I play Poke, uh, Pokesnap too many times to keep count on N64. Really excited to get this game one day and replay it over and over. Yeah. I don't know how many hours I spent on that game, but I honestly, it was one of the only ones I had for N64, and I was obsessed with Pokemon, so I played it constantly. Oh, okay, I see, I see. Uh, we'll do that one. Yeah, I believe you yeah. have. It's good to see you again. <laughs> nice seeing you again. Um, what were you, oh, you were playing Breath of the Wild. How was Breath of the Wild? I'm so, I I have a love-hate relationship with that game because it's beautiful, but I'm really, really bad at it, so I get really frustrated with it. Uh, but it is an incredible game. There's gotta be a way to make Pinsir, like, come up out of the dirt. I know they wouldn't put a Pinsir there and just show the horns. So there's gotta be a way. The game is called Bug Snacks. I have actually heard of Bug Snacks. Um, a couple of people have suggested it to me, but I've never even seen any gameplay of it, so I need to check that out. It was free with PS5 when I got it, and it's just a fun game where you're a reporter on an island that's overrun by bugs that look like IRL snacks, and you need to figure out why it's happening. Neat. That sounds like a good time. Yeah, I need to check into that. It's always good to come by here. Well, thank you so much for bringing your community here and stopping by. It's always lovely to see you. And like, I I always feel honored when people like choose us to raid because like there's so many like cool people out there. So thank you for choosing us to bring your community to. Look how ad okay, look how effing cute that picture is. It's so adorable. It makes me sick. And Torterra, my baby, nestled up to Grookey, my other baby. It just warms my little heart. <laughs> So we're picking this one. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I'm doing well, thanks for asking. Ooh, uh, no, I, I am doing good. Uh, I've mentioned a couple times in stream, it was a, a little bit of a rough day, but you know, we all have rough days occasionally. But um, I'm better now. This game is very entertaining. It's very cute, it's very bright, so it's cheering me up. And I've got lots of friends here, so that's always nice too. Oh, let me do... Uh, I know we got a shout out for Nancy Drew thing, and I again, if you're not following Nancy Drew thing, please, 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 uh, drop her a follow. She's lovely. <clears throat> We're gonna do a shout out for Mad Lad Liam. He has been playing through uh, Bloodborne recently, and those games are so awesome. It's always really cool to watch people play through those because they have so such cool monsters and creature design. 
And uh, he seems to be doing pretty well with it. Okay, this is for Pichu. I think this one is more centered, so we're going to go with that one. Uh, my girlfriend loved the game too, and she's not a gamer at all. Uh, but it was funny when she would ask me to play it. She tells everyone to play it. She's adorable. Awesome. Yeah, I need to, like, like I said, I haven't even seen even 30 seconds of gameplay. I haven't even seen a trailer for it. So I need to look into it because I've had multiple people suggest it to me. And it seems like it would be my type of game. Because I love, like, anything cutesy and adorable and stuff that doesn't take much skill. <laughs> because, unlike you, I am not good at games. Like, I... I would never attempt something like Bloodborne because I know it's a pointless endeavor to begin with. Like, there, there's no no chance of me ever finishing that game. Um, let's go with this one. And then I think all of our pictures of Combi were garbage. Oh no no no! We actually got him facing the front. Okay. Okay. So we did get one decent one. It's not centered, but it's pretty close and it's facing forward. Uh, yes. That must be why we're friends. I'm cutesy, adorable, and no skill. Whatever, you have plenty of skill. I've heard all about your your gaming abilities, so don't even try that, Mr. Galen. And yes, you are cutesy, you are adorable. I will agree with you there. It's a score bunny. Lies, lies and slander, never. I hope you have an awesome night and day tomorrow. I'll talk to you soon. I must go to bed. All right, no worries. Thank you so much for swinging by. Again, y'all should drop uh, Mad Lad Liam a follow. Uh, I've only been able to catch a couple of the streams. I usually like lurk because I'm awkward around new people, but please drop him a follow. He's very nice. I've interacted with him in uh, Tamale Johnson's chat and he's good people. Seems like something caught its attention. Okay. The more Pokemon you get in the photo... Okay. Well, that counts as two, right? Yeah, other Pokemon. Okay, so that did count. We got two Diamond Stars on that one. Nice. Not bad for our first shot of it. But yes, good night. Sleep well. Take care. Thank you again. Uh, next we got Buffalant. Looks awfully strong. Look at it sleeping. Nice it's so cute. 2,000. Okay. <gasps> we got a new record. Hmm, do I want to... I guess I'll keep the sleeping one, even though I really like that one. It's so pretty and colorful, and it's wearing the little flower crown. But this one is objectively better, I guess, by the rating system, so we're going to go with that. Murkrow. I feel like we're not going to get very, very many points for this one, but we'll see. Oh, okay. Not not terrible. We get a gold star, so that's not bad for our first shot. We just gotta get some better timing on that and maybe get more in the shot. I feel like we could have gotten a closer picture of Caterpie as well. But, you know, we're gonna go through it two or three more times. Well, two more times, maybe. If it unlocks a new map, then we'll move on to that one. <clears throat> nice placement score. Okay. Pincer. Yeah, there's something up with this one. There's got to be a, a, a way to, like... And see, like, it keeps alerting me to, like, the flowers. So I'm wondering if there's something that I can do that, like, maybe activates the flower to release something. And maybe it makes the Pokemon around it do something different. I don't know. Haven't figured that out yet. When framing your shot, be careful how the position... Okay, well, it's under the dirt, so, you know. Torch this picture... I want to print this picture out and put it on my wall. It's so freaking adorable. I can't stand it. Ah, oh, look at that diamond star. <laughs> Picture of Pidgeot's wing. Yeah, I didn't expect that one to be very good. 
That's fine. We'll replace it. We'll do better. Nice it's a mysterious one. It seems calm. Yes. Okay, good. Can we keep that new one? Peach. Surely this one is better. It's centered. It's sleeping. Looking all cutesy. Nice okay. Okay. We did better. Very nice. I'm happy with that. Yeah, I think we'll do the nighttime track one more time because I'm sure there's there was a lot going on, so I'm sure there's stuff that we missed. But if it unlocks a new part, then we're, we'll do that after this time. New record. Uh, yeah, we'll go with the sleeping one, because that's just too cute. Too cute. Nice work. Seems to be swimming. Oh, okay. Okay, so we got a two-star on that one. Okay. Good, good, good. Also, here in a moment, you might hear our Chow Chow start borking at the door because they're wanting to come in here. So I might have to let him in and hopefully he won't knock over my green screen. But he's getting all huffy. I can hear him at the door now. Ugh. Do any of y'all have dogs that you absolutely adore but they are absolute little brats? Like little spoiled brat babies? It's like having a little like mouthy child. Let him in. He's going to mess up the green screen. <laughs> Hold on. One sec. Just a moment. Child, what is your problem? Here, you want to come in here? Oh, you're trying to... Oh, hold on. Children, you drive me insane, but I love you. Goodness gracious. Uh, yes, mine was biting me during stream again. Oh, nice. Well, uh, Bruin, that I just let in um, literally seven minutes ago, he wanted to go back outside. He was the one that was getting huffy. And when I went to go let him outside, Moose decided he wanted to come into the room. So he is sleeping behind the green screen, and we're going to hope that our giant clumsy moose child does not knock, knock over the screen screen. Obviously, if that happens, you will notice it. So, we're just going to hope for the best and keep going. <laughs> do, do, do. I'm going to keep one of my earbuds out so that I can hear when Bruin gets all huffy and wants to come back in probably five minutes from now. We have really got to get a doggy door installed. Because he is, oh, this is random, but Rachel, you might, you might appreciate this, this beautiful skull mason jar. Isn't it adorable? I love it. So redeem that mouth thing. Really? Why do y'all have to do this right after we get like raids? Y'all are subjecting these sweet people who don't even know me to this disgusting, horrible thing. All right. <laughs> I love that emote. That that's the first time I've seen the uh the motion emotes. That's adorable. Okay, let's go ahead and rate this. Okay, we got Combi for the first time. Crystals and cats redeem Birdie Bot's beans. Oh, sweet. So thanks, y'all. Y'all are really um doing me some favors. Alright. Alright. Uh I guess I'll go ahead and get the mouth thing out of the way. And then we will do... Oh my goodness, that petting of the doge one. That's so cute. Alright. I imagine the Pokemon behave differently at this hour. Keep up the good work. We care about you all. Well, thank you all so much for being here. And using your channel points that are hard-earned. You've had to sit by and listen to me so many hours to earn those points. So thank you for spending them in a disgusting way. Okay. So we're going to do that mouth thing. Get it out of the way. 
Again, okay, anyone who is new here and lurking, I am so sorry. It's one of our channel point redemptions. It's gross, but it is what it is. It's a it's a disgusting sound, so if disgusting sounds bother you, you might not want to listen. So Initiation by fire. <laughs> Still have ten thousand K, remember? Oh or ten thousand, wow. Of course you do so. Alright. Mouthfire boater mom. For real? What is wrong with you all? Why are you doing this to me? I'm just trying to have a nice chill stream. But good morning, boater mom. How's it going? Okay, here we go. Okay. We're done with that. We're not doing it any more time. I'm the leader of the pack. <laughs> you are. I truly believe that because you are the master of lurking. And while we're doing all these beans, what that mouth do? Oh no. <laughs> uh, one of the more horrible things it can do. Uh, Lilo and Switch, hello, hello. Good morning, well, I adult. Thank you for the lurk. Okay, I'm gonna do some quick shout outs and then we're gonna get back to the game. Or well, we're gonna get to the beans and then we're gonna get to the game. Okay, um, so we're gonna do a shout out for Sil because he is an, uh, an excellent buddy of ours who's been supporting us since the start. Uh, lately, he's been obsessed with Dead by Daylight, but he also plays like Fallout 76 and things like that. Uh, we're gonna do a shout out for Miss Crystals and Cats, our friend Rachel. She makes jewelry, uh, absolutely stunning beauty, beautiful jewelry. Uh, she hangs out with her adorable kitty cats and plays World of Warcraft occasionally. Um, we're also going to do Boater Mom because Boater Mom is perfect and wonderful and lovely and plays a ton of Animal Crossing and Cozy Grove and has a wonderful community. And then we're going to do Lilo and Switch. She is lovely, also has a great community. Today she was playing Monster Hunter Stories, which I really wanted to see, but I did not have time to stop by the stream. But she also plays a lot of, po uh, not Pokemon. She also plays a lot of Animal Crossing. So please go follow all these people. I promise if I shout them out, they're good people and they have good communities. So go follow them, you won't regret it. Okay, so we're gonna do Crystals and Cats Redeemed, Birdie Bots Every Flavor Bean. So we're gonna do one of those. Thank you so much for the shout out, I appreciate it. Oh, no worries. Thank you for stopping by. I'm sad that I missed the Monster Hunter stories. I really, I need to go back and watch the VOD because I wanna see what that game's all about. Okay, I swear to God. Okay, and Galen has redeemed, what, are y'all just like redeeming everything all at once? What's wrong with you people? Okay, so I either got earwax, rotten egg, or lemon. I can almost guarantee it's not lemon. I am fairly certain it's rotten egg. Yep. Yep. Rotten egg. <laughs> I hate it. I don't even want to chew it. I wish I could just swallow it without chewing it, but I can't. It's so bad. I hate it. Ugh, oh, just getting it, getting it swallowed is difficult. All right, and I'm gonna switch hats. We're gonna put on our Bulbasaur hat. Um, yeah, that'll work. And then we're gonna do a fire bean because that's what Boater Mum redeemed. Can't wait. Mouth fire to wash it down, yeah, exactly. All right, let's see which one I got. I'm fairly certain I got Carolina Reaper, which is the hottest, but it's so hard to tell because it looks like the middle one, which is Cayenne. But either way, disgusting and I hate it. But here we go. These are so bad. These are so much worse than the birdie bots. I can't even swallow it. <sighs> yep, that is the Carolina Reaper. It is burning my throat and it feels like my mouth is actually breathing fire. 
I don't have any milk. <clears throat> Oh, that doesn't help. Not even a little. <clears throat> Thanks for uh, all the redemptions, you lovely people. Um, we got the hat. We got the Brady Vox flavor, every flavor bean. We got the fire bean. My mouth is like drooling, I think, trying to get rid of the heat. Um, but the rotten egg taste is gone, so there's that. <clears throat> and we did that mouth thing, so... My tongue is on fire. It's literally on fire right now. <laughs> Butter Mom, how, uh, did you start the new job today or is it in the morning that you start it? Or no, no, it must be today, right? I don't know, I, my days are all mixed up. You went on your first uh, expedition to the park at night, okay. <laughs> I hate it. And also, I'm sorry for the hat. I'm, of course, it's Bulbasaur, so it's green. Uh, so it's not really picking up too well on the camera, but I had to wear my Bulbasaur shirt and my Bulbasaur hat because Bulbasaur is forever number one and he's my baby. Today at nine, awesome. I'm so excited for you. I'm wishing you all the luck. I'm crossing my fingies and my toes and I hope you have a lovely day. Also, this is random, but this reminds me. Uh, I do lurkies while I wow for a bit. Oh, no worries. Enjoy the world of Warcraft. Again, y'all should follow uh, Crystals and Cats because occasionally she plays Warcraft. I don't think she's streaming it tonight, um, but she does play Warcraft. Most of the time, her streams are jewelry making, but uh, she does play some Warcraft. All right. Um, none of these are really anything I want to save except for this one. We are saving that for sure. God, I love it. I would legit print that out. And I think Nintendo is releasing something where you can actually print out pictures. I'm not going to buy it because, you know, that's a waste of my money. But I think they are coming up with something like that. Um... Ugh, my tongue is on fire. I <laughs> like, every time I breathe, it's just, it like reactivates it. I didn't have, like, I didn't bring milk because I didn't think someone would be redeeming that. <laughs> okay. Oh. Hmm, that's intriguing. What's going on? That sounded like the Resident Evil, like, door opening scenes. WB, what is up, friend? Come on, Pokemon Snap, right? Come through. Some of these Pokemon are serving it. Here's the thing. And look at that thick baby back there, just flaunting it right in front of the camera. Just nonchalantly. When you got near that field of flowers, I picked up an incredible strong energy reading. Also. Its source seemed to be... <sighs> um, oh, so... Because I had to stop and, um, you know, do all the redemptions and got distracted and was doing all the shout outs. I don't know if you all saw in our Discord, but uh, my husband created a meme about me and my play style and my streaming style. Um, he he <laughs> seems to think that I avoid playing the games, which is partially true, but I like to interact with people. So. It sort of seemed to be moving too, if only slightly. I wonder what that's about. Because it mentioned it while I was on the map, but I didn't see anything. Which suggests what we've got here is... An Illumina Pokemon? We can't be sure yet, but I suspect so. I wonder why it showed up. Did you do anything special? I also doubt that it appeared when it did... I also doubt that it appeared when it did by chance. I don't think I did anything. Not that I noticed. So I think you should be the one to investigate the area where that reading is coming from. <clears throat> they definitely took that sound from RE. I mean, it, it straight up sounded like the old video games, like where you open the door and walk through. And like, instantly reminded me of that. But how are you doing, WB? I hope your Monday, uh, I hope your week started out well. What? Hope you got to do something fun. I want to go see too. Are you at work right now? You can watch through the monitor with me, Rita. Right. 
Please head out as soon as you're ready. Okay, so we're gonna do that one more time. Yeah, and we're sweaty spaghetti. Oh no, I'm sorry. Man, I feel you though, because like at, at the hospital lately, our air conditioner has been messed up in our department, and it has been so, so miserable. Um, and you know, we have to wear like these like heavy plastic gowns, and we've got to wear the, the head coverings, and the, the mask, and the, the cow inseminating gloves, and all of that. So, it is quite miserable. Okay, let's go to the Illumina spot in the nature park. We might find an Illumina Pokemon there. Alright, I don't know what I did to... Oh, the Illumina spot. Okay. So it takes me, like, directly to it? Okay. I guess we'll check this out. I wanted to do another run-through of the park at night, but let's check out the Illumina thing. Torn with a beanie, looking drippy as usual. Oh yeah, I got that drip. But it's Bulbasaur, so... It's not reacting well to the green screen, but I had to represent my baby Bul uh, Bulbasaur, so. But what is up, Adagio? How's it going? Oh, damn. Same here. We have to wear it all while we fog the whole... Oof. Yeah, that would be miserable. Man, I'm sorry. But I understand your pain. Well, that's definitely where the reading was coming from. Do you see or hear anything? <gasps> What's happening? It's so pretty. This game is so, like, vibrant. And, like, the colors are just... Ugh, oh, I love it. <gasps> Woo! I've never been able to say this one's right. This name, right? M Mega... Mega Janium? Me Mega... Something. <laughs> it's very pretty, though. Meganium, there we go. Oh, okay. Come on. Serve. Okay, okay. Work. Oh, okay. Well, we've got a great shot of its b-hole if we want that. But, uh... <gasps> Ooh, it's eating. Sniffing the flower. It's getting high. Ooh, look at it. <gasps> look. Ooh. What is going on? Is it getting high? Snorting that flower? So am I... I assume there's no other... Others doing that right now. No, I don't... I didn't mean to do that. Okay. I don't know which of these will actually be a decent picture, but I'm just going to keep taking a ton of them, because it seems to be what it wants me to focus on. It's so majestic. Okay, is it gonna do it again? <gasps> Ooh, okay. <clears throat> Stunning. Okay. So I wonder if there are multiple Pokemon that come out and like sniff those flowers and kind of like activate. It seems to, I mean, they said it's the Illumina Pokemon, so maybe it's the only one in this park that does that. I'm not really sure. I guess we'll figure it out, though. It's looking at me. God, it's so cute. I love it. I hate the earlier evolutions of it, but when it gets to this point, I really, really like it. It's really pretty. Uh, Chikorita, I think. Uh, let's see. Bulbasaur is best boy. Yes, forever my number one. He's my baby. I'm wearing my Bulbasaur shirt. I've shown it couple of times but it's my baby and uh, I have lots of bubble shore shirts unfortunately most of them are green so I can't wear them on stream but um, <gasps> Tamale Johnson hello popping in to say hey hey always lovely to see you how's it going friend I hope you're doing well uh, thank you for even stopping by for a few moments uh, where did you get that hat I got this I hate that it's not showing up but you know green screen um, I got it probably nine years ago at a convention. I think it was either Anime Week in Atlanta or Anime Blast Chattanooga or Con Nuga. I'm not really sure, but it was at a convention. 
that was mainly anime focused, um, and I I could not pass it up. Um, how are you liking the game? Boy, this is surely different than the 64. Oh yeah, for real, massively different. It's so gorgeous. I love it. Um, I'm really enjoying it so far. I know it's a repetitive game, but that's just the nature of this type of game. Uh, it's like someone mentioned earlier, I think it was Galen, it's very grindy, but I'm, I'm liking it so far, but that might, might just be because it's so new to me and I'm just like enamored with all the colors and seeing all the Pokemon interacting out in the world, but I'm gonna try to find it on eBay. Oh yeah, yeah, I'm sure it's out there. Like, I'm sure if you search like Etsy or something, you can find it. And like, they had, you know, tons of different Pokemon. I haven't seen anything from this game yet, but I'm already sold. This Pokemon Snap, heck yeah. It's ballin' so far. Doing great, sort of a last second late night goof up. How are you? Oh, well, I'm glad that you're here, goof up or not. And if y'all are not following my, um, my very handsome, bearded, tattooed, wonderful friend who is obsessed with horror and is part of the Final Boys, uh, you should follow Tamale Johnson. He says he's not good at games, but he is really good at games. And he has the persistence of a champion, I guess. I don't know, <laughs> but he he will play. Wait, oh, no, 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 no. Woo! That would have been foolish. Okay. I don't know which one's gonna be like the best. I think one of the photos where it's like going through that, like doing that kind of uh, glowy thing like this. Where it's like in ecstasy. That's hot. That's hot. It is really into that. It's feeling that moment. Okay, so this one or this one? I feel like I'm gonna go with this one just because it's got that look on its face and it's just like in, in like literally ecstasy. Uh, I am also bearded and tattooed and love heart. True. That is true. Oh, did I not give you a shout out? I thought I gave you one. My bad. I was probably distracted when you came in. I was literally like, oh, it's me. <laughs> I'm so sorry, WB. You are right. I could have sworn I gave you one, but I think I was distracted when you came in. <clears throat> yeah, I needed to print out some very important documents tonight, and I forgot, so I'm trying to find a printer shop at 10 p.m. Oh, well, I know, I don't know about you, but I know our Kinko's, if you have one of those near you, I think ours is 24 hours. I don't know about where you are, but. Okay, so yeah, we're going to go with this one. Yeah, we're going to go with that. Uh, Mag <laughs> Meganiagasm, <laughs> yes. Apparently, like, it is really feeling those flowers. Yeah, I thought Tom was talking about you. Oh, well, I mean, WB is also, like he said, very handsome, also bearded. The beard is coming back. Um, I know there for a while, uh, it was full and luscious, and there was an incident where it had to be trimmed back a bit, but... It is coming back, and it's beautiful, and even without it, WB is still gl glorious and, and handsome and fashionable and entertaining. Mistakes were made. I am so sorry that I forgot to shout you out and that I was talking about another beautiful bearded man. <laughs> but yes, y'all should also follow our friend WB. He is hilarious. He plays a ton of like Skyrim-type games. Uh, let's see, Skyrim. I think I've seen um, Watch Dogs. Um, horror games, tons of horror games, Dead by Daylight, uh, and when he gets spooked, it is absolutely hilarious. I meant my beard mess up was a mistake. Oh, I got you. <laughs> yeah. But, you know, it happens. We've all had that happen where you're just trying to trim up your beard and then the slightest thing goes wrong and you're like, well, guess I've got to get rid of it all now, so... And he said tamale, and I was like, oops. <laughs> and I, oop. Yeah, my bad. But both of you all are both handsome, tattooed, bearded gentlemen, and I appreciate both of you very much. I don't think that you have a horror podcast, though, that I'm aware of, WB. All right. Yet. <laughs> Another step forward for our research. I bet Pokemon in the area are getting comfortable with you. I do not. <laughs> you get a score of 5,000 points or more. Ooh, okay. Nice pose. All right. Gentle Wonder, you registered the Illumina Pokemon Meganium to your, 
I am so sorry. Uh, I think the um, the fiery bean is making my Taco Bell from earlier tonight repeat on me. So I'm being rude and burping into the camera. Or the microphone, excuse me. I've heard it. You've heard what? Oh, you've heard uh, WB's um, uh, podcast, his horror podcast. You got a filter. Ooh, cell shaded. That's pretty. Interesting. I didn't know that you like unlock new filters and stuff. Mm, burps, hot. And they are hot burps because uh, Boater Mom a few minutes ago made me eat one of the bean boozled fiery beans and it was the Carolina Reaper one. So that was rough. All I do is burp. You do burp quite a bit. But when you do it, it seems right. It seems right. Homestead hero, Jakey, hello. Glad I could finally see your handsome face again. How's the stream going? It is going well. Um, we're having fun. I'm doing exactly what my husband said in the meme that he posted today on our Discord. Um, I'm avoiding playing the actual game because I'm too enthralled talking to my friends in chat. But we're gonna keep on. We're gonna we're gonna continue. Uh, but how's it going, Jakey? What's up? Can we get a shout out for Homestead Hero, please? If there are any mods in the chat, please. Because Homestead Hero is amazing. He is a very sweet person. He's a writer. He's super creative. Uh, he's always got wild stories to tell about his characters in his video games. He plays a lot of farm sims. Um, and uh, visual novels. I think, is that, is that what they're called? Visual novels? Um, oh, yeah. Meganium is really feeling it here. We're going to save that. And he also does uh, voices for all of his Stardew villagers and his uh, Story of Seasons villagers. Ooh, how was Mario Golf? How did that go? Thank you for the shout out, Buttermum. Okay, I think that's all I'm gonna save. We're gonna do another night run of the the um, the park though, because there's I know there's a lot that I missed, and I've got to figure out how to make some of the there's got to be a way to make the pokemon react like uh the ones that aren't facing towards you or the ones that are buried under the ground there's got to be something to that so we've got to figure that out see i have the opposite problem i focus too much on the yeah i i mean no i'm not agreeing with you um it, you, it's hard to find a good balance sometimes because sometimes you get so enthralled with the game that it's you know you forget about chat because like when I was playing The Walking Dead, it was hard for me to keep up with chat. And like with this, you have a lot of break time. So it's easy to like get caught up in chat, like just fall into talking to people. That was amazing, right? Wasn't it gorgeous? Wasn't it huge? And wasn't it saying something? <gasps> easy there, Rita. Take a deep breath. Look who's talking. You were practically dancing, Professor. Moving on. Um... Mm -mm -mm. Thank you for the shout out, Torn, RP Genius, and Boner Mom. Uh, I'm doing good. Dose off by accident, though, so I'm a little disoriented. Oh no. Yeah, it's always like weird when you wake up from an unintentional nap. It's very disorienting. Hello, sweet friend. How are you holding up uh, tonight? Oh, RP Genius. Okay. I haven't found that balance yet. Yeah, I, I clearly. I'm not good at it. And it's apparently so obvious that <laughs> it happens in every stream. And uh, Hasiel made... It was a funny meme, but it pointed out my um, my streaming style that I didn't really notice myself. But he right. He has points. He made points. Points were made. Didn't they supposedly save Lentil from a huge disaster a long time ago or something? So the story goes, yes. Illumina Pokemon were also said to have distinctive patterns and to glow with unusual light. A light that comes with, from within. Like many of you. <clears throat> Same here, just sleepy. Happiness uh, to hear you're doing well. OMG, I'll do right now. I'm sorry, I'm dumb. Wait. What's happening? Did you send me that thing? <gasps> Ooh, what is June Gloom sending you? Now I want to know. I'm nosy. <clears throat> is it something saucy? I'm heading to sleep, actually. I only work one day this week, thank God, and it's tomorrow. So have a fabulous night, friends. Much loved all. Thank you so much, RP Genius. I thank you again for um, rigging your contest so that I can win it. Uh, I can't wait to see what game I get. And it's always lovely being in your streams. And I'm very happy that you have time off from work. 
So enjoy your, your one day of work, and hopefully it's pretty painless. And I will see you soon. I'm convinced the events in those legends actually did happen, or really did happen. Discovering the true history of this region could be the key that opens up all of our research. Hang on, wasn't there one more important thing you were going to mention, Professor? That's alright. It's pretty light. Let's pick up the conversation from here tomorrow. Well, I'm going back through the park in the dark. It's the most fun in the park when you're laughing in the dark. One of my friends bought me a Zebo the Clown uh, pillow, and it is super cute. It's right behind me, but I don't think it would read well on camera because it's got some green on it. Sleep tight and sweet dreams. Good morning. Did you manage to get some sleep? Yes, I did. Now, as Rita already told you, I've been preparing to launch an ecological survey spanning the entire lentil region. And no sooner had you arrived than we suddenly found an Illumina Pokemon. You think there's a connection, Professor? I really hate the speed at which this dialogue, like, prints out. Like, I really want it to speed up a little bit. I can't be sure yet. But fascinating things are bound to happen if you come come with us. Really? <clears throat> really? Well, you know, maybe. You also left a bitch unanswered. Ooh! June Gloom is busy. He got things going on. Give him a break. Do not be mean to June Gloom. He my baby, and only I, only I, can be a bully and a bitch <laughs> to June Gloom. Nick Stitch, thank you for the lurk. It's always lovely to see you. I hope you're doing well. For a scientist, you sure can be vague sometimes, Professor. Still, I think it's a good idea. It'll be way more fun with you along. Well, there you have it. Ready to officially join our research team? June hates me. I'm not being mean. June hates me. Whatever. Can you imagine if, like, he just felt obligated to continue hanging out with all of us when really, like, he hates all of us? <laughs> I don't think that's the case, though. Yep. It's like you were born to wear it. Ooh, I got some cute little badge. Well, what are we waiting for? Adventure awaits. I'm always down for some badges. Not to rain on your parade, Rita, but... I need to get a couple more things ready first. Aw, oh, come on. So the professor is kind of handsome. I know I'm like a kid in this game, so I shouldn't be thinking he's handsome, but he's handsome. Just a little bit longer, all right? I promise it'll be worth the wait. I'll explain next time you're headed out to do some research. Mm -mm. Team badge, you officially joined the Lentil Region research team. Yay, it's so pretty. A profile icon. Okay. <clears throat> okay, so we're gonna go we're gonna do at least one more run through at night. Because I know there's so much that we missed. <clears throat> there's always just so much going on and you turn so slowly. Now that you're a full fledged team member, I have something for you that will come in handy. Ooh, it's an apple. Or what do they call the fruit in this? Let's see. As for the explanation, would you do the honors, Rita? Yeah. You say that as, as if people weren't foaming at the mouth over Pokemon Go, Professor. Oh, true. Yeah. We, um... We actually have, like, pictures, like, fan art that we bought at cons of, like, the leaders and things from Pokemon Go. So, yes. You're right. But is it just me, or have you been getting to do a lot, uh, a lot more of the work lately, Professor? I mean, he is the one in charge, so... Oh well, time to explain the great... I... Here I am, I'm like, I wish the dialogue would go faster, and here I can't even get through, like, the simple sentences. Oh well, time to explain, like, the great assistant I am. So I'm taking bets that she grows up to become Rita. I said the same thing earlier! Yes! <laughs> I'm like, she looks... She looks like she could be her. Fluff fruit. Okay, they're sweet and tasty, and they make a great snack for Pokemon. Fluff fruit. Okay. They may look just like regular apples, but they're way lighter and softer. I don't know if I'd like them softer. Gross. Uh, you'll probably make a Pokemon's Day if you toss one of these. Right. Let's get you some practice. Fluff fruit. Oh, I 
I can't move the camera. Okay. There. Shit. It came to get a plate. Who doesn't love a little snack? You can move the plate here around to aim your throw. Yeah. It's the same as aiming your camera. Okay. Just move the left stick to aim, and then press the B button to throw. Okay. Give it another try. Okay. Is there any more Pokemon? I don't want to feed Pikachu again. Really? N all the other Pokemon in the area have vacated. They're just... Okay, Rita. We get it. We get it. Ugh. Fine. Here. Come here. Whatever. Look at it rolling around over there like a doofus. Trying to be cute. More cautious than hungry. That doesn't... No. That doesn't make sense to me. Hunger always comes first. Don't forget what I told you, okay? Mm-hmm. Well, I'm doomed. All the 24-hour kink don't exist any longer. Oh, no. I wonder if that's something... Because, like, I know all of our 24-hour Walmarts here in the area, they are no longer 24 hours. Um, because that happened, you know, during the pandemic, and they just figured out that they weren't really losing any money so yeah they're no longer 24 hours so that is very unfortunate how much time have you put into this so far not i've only been streaming well i've been streaming like almost three hours but obviously i haven't made much progress which i know that's my bad but i get distracted i will admit it i know i get distracted but i am enjoying it so much or i am enjoying it uh very much so far so I guess now we'll wait until the professor gives us the green light to move on. Oh, I've got an idea. You should try testing out fluff fruit and taking some more photos in the meantime. The professor says there are all kinds of ways to use it. Finish explaining, I see. Thanks, Rita. I've got one more thing to tell you about for now. I thought it would be handy to have a quick way to share what we see and learn in the field. Are you too familiar with Lentalk? It rings a bell, I think. It's a communication tool folks here in Lentil use. Rita, let's say you notice something exciting in the field. You can send a photo and a description over Lentalk. I can use it to send things I notice on the monitor too. That sounds super fun. Look for Lentalk messages in the top right of the screen at the research camp and elsewhere. They ought to help. Okay. I'm doing well, my friend. May have accidentally screwed up my sleep schedule though. Oh, that sucks. Um, whoa, 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 what's with the Pikachu slant? Yeah, I'm just, I'm not a fan of Pikachu. <laughs> I'm sorry to disappoint you. I'm just not. Very overrated, in my opinion. I mean, when you're close to 1,000 Pokemon, and you're still constantly using Pikachu and Eevee as, like, the, the main Pokemon that you put on your merchandising, like, no. There's so many cute Pokemon to choose from. Oh no, that's the most, uh, that's me most of the time. Might have overslept a bit today. Well, you needed the sleep, June. Hopefully you feel rested at least. Uh, same here, everything is closed. What about us late night monsters? Yeah, for real. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, okay, so I guess I can't do anything. Yeah, it's, it's definitely a big change. I'm hoping once we get a little bit further away from the COVID stuff that things start going back to like 24 hours because... I am definitely not, um, yeah, I like, I, I prefer to do my shopping, like Walmart grocery shopping and stuff in the middle of the night when nobody's there or like right after I get off work at six in the morning or seven in the morning. Okay. We're going to do one more night run. I feel very self-conscious now. I'm taking too long. <laughs> I should have had another map open by now. Good luck. Uh. Oh. I should have used that on score bunny. I forgot that was a thing. Um, 
these are all asleep. I don't think they're gonna. Oh no, it's not. Can't be bothered. I'm trying to find stuff that I haven't already found before. eating. Cute. Okay. Murkrows can't be bothered. Okay. I don't, I don't know. I wish it would quit doing that. How do we make it... I don't understand how you're supposed to make it, like, react. Because now it doesn't even have the horns out. I'm assuming these things will maybe become more clear. I don't want to anger it and wake it up, but I'm going to try. God, they're so cute. They're perfect babies. Wait, was that glowing? Was that an Illumina Pokemon? What was that? Turn around. I'm not getting very many quality pictures this run. Ah! I keep getting the buttons mixed up now that they've introduced more. Did the Murkrow settle somewhere? Oh, there's a pincer. Okay. Sweet. Yes. Ah. Man, I'm not doing very well at all. I'm almost at the end of the map. Can I hit it? The stick, stupid. The stick. Okay, so that the combi will react to the fruit. Oh, 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 it's awake. Yeah, it would be really beneficial if I would. Oh my god, look how cute! Oh my god. Okay, so I didn't get many quality pictures there. And it, like I said, it would be really beneficial if I would stop pressing the wrong buttons, but it is what it is. Back. For a split second, the combi looked like a pair of balls. <laughs> I mean, it do. You're right. A giant set of flying testicles. Score bunny is chilling. My little baby. We got a really cute picture of it earlier as well, sleeping. We already have one picture of it sleeping, but this is like chilling out, maxing, relaxing all cool, so. Okay, so that one's not better, so we're not gonna do that. I'm gonna see, this is a, a picture of it eating, but it's not facing the camera. So I'm gonna do, I'm gonna see what we get for this one. What is this? Oh. That, no. Wait, oh, that was Caterby. No, that's not a good picture. Look at that baby. Torterra is one of my absolute favorites. Okay, we I know we got better pictures of, of Pidget. Pidgeot this time. Pidgeot. Okay, 
Ducklet, we'll see. Yeah, I think those... maybe. We'll submit it and see. Me throwing an apple at it. That's a cute picture with the stars in the background. Let's see. I guess we'll go with that. And... Hmm. That or that? That's a cooler picture, but I feel... Okay, that's a two-star. See, I don't... I'm still not understanding this. the two-star or three-star ratings, like how they rate those. I don't know what that means, necessarily. Um, I like this picture better, though. So I'm gonna go with that one. Combi, I don't think we got anything spectacular, so... Okay. Uh, yes. I really like my score bunny and sword. I... I'm okay with score bunny. I don't have anything wrong uh, with score bunny. I went with uh, Grookey because, you know, usually I go with the plant starter. Not always, but usually. But, of course, you know, you gotta get them all, because why not? Yay, 4200, nice. We got a diamond star for that one. It's a two star photo, okay, good, good. Not bad, two, star, two gold stars. I hope after this one it unlocks a new map, because I've done I've done quite a few nighttime, or well, quite a few daytime, and then two nighttime ones, I think. Nice work. Yeah, look at that that picture up there with Torterra sleeping, and it's got Grookey and Pichu sleeping right beside it. My heart, I love it so much. Grookey all the way. He's my favorite new Pokemon uh, from that mediocre game. What? Oh, I love Sword and Shield. But I will agree, he's the best starter. That drum master mode, he goes rent. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. I agree. Next, we've got Pidgeot. That's one cool Pokemon. This has to be better. Okay, good. Apologies for the dog snores in the background. Next, we've got ducklets. All right, doing better, doing better. Ooh, look at that. Okay, very nice. Hoot hoot. This is probably about the same. Just a little bit, okay. Um, I guess I'll go with that one. I was being harsh. It really wasn't that bad. I still haven't picked up the DLC. It was really, really fun, and I powered through it. I was just still a bit upset they didn't include all the Pokemon. Yeah, yeah, I can, I get that completely. That's what I was talking to. Um, I think who was like, oh, Apple Glass last night. Uh, we were talking. You know, Pokemon has been a thing for 25 years now, and most of us have been playing since the beginning. And. It still astounds me that Nintendo doesn't listen to what the players really want. It's like they give you some of the things, but never all of the things. So I like it, but yeah, there are de there's definitely room for improve improvement. And I, I am with you. I have not done the DLC. I need to do that. But I have just not gotten around to it yet. <gasps> Nintendo Gamer 1992. Hello. How is it going, friend? I am glad that I caught a bit of your stream this morning, but unfortunately, because I was in a doctor's office, uh, it was very, very quiet, and I didn't have my headphones with me, so I couldn't really hear, but I was watching. <laughs> How's it going? Let's do a shout-out for Nintendo Gamer 1992. Should give them a follow. They are lovely. Oh, thank you, Boater Mom. <laughs> uh, I forget that I have some mods in here. Um, but yes, please go give uh, Nintendo Gamer a follow. Uh, they were playing Mario Kart this morning. Um, I haven't 
that was the first stream I've been able to catch of theirs. Uh, but they seem to be uh, pretty big into Nintendo games, clearly. Uh, so we all love those. So please drop them a follow. It's Nintendo. If they just uh, did a hair more, their games would be flawless, especially Pokemon. Agree. Are you lovely gentlemen picking up Pearl and Diamond? Oh, yeah, yeah. I'll be getting it. Because I, um, I really liked... I don't know... You know, I, I very rarely get on and look at the opinions of people as far as, like, how they feel about games, because I like to make my own opinion. But, um, I really, really liked Let's Go Eevee, so I was totally down for the, um, the Pearl, uh, remake, the Pearl and Diamond remake. Bless you, um, but thank you very much for dropping by, much appreciate. Oh, no worries. I, uh, I, you know, I had it... I had the volume on very low, and I was, like, holding it up to my ear, but people were looking at me weird, so, <laughs> I stopped. Um, but yes, I was there. Let's see. Um, Pokemon Snap. Hello, Clementine. What is up? Thank you for the shout-out, too. So kind of you. Oh, no worries. I didn't know, uh, gonna stream because I felt so ill. Oh, no. I'm sorry you're not feeling well. I hope you get to feeling better. Hopefully it's just, like, a, a cold or something, um, that's not too serious. Oh yeah, we're gonna keep the original because that other one is trash. With Togepi and Pichu, uh, oh, I wanna go. I wanna let's go Johto. Yes, I agree. Let's go Eevee made me cry. It's so cute. I like. I I really enjoyed that game. Uh, with Togepi and Pichu, I really had fun with Let's Go Eevee and Pikachu. Let the haters hate. I love my stupid Pokeball. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that. You've hit a new stage in your research. Keep an eye out for changes, no matter how small. Oh, wait. I thought we were already level 2. Weren't we working towards level 3? Or are there different levels depending on, like, the day and night? I'm confused. I'm confused. But yes, uh, Clementine, how was your day? And how did, uh, is... I don't... I assume Evelyn's not awake at this point. But hopefully she enjoyed her visit from the Tooth Fairy. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm. Just following. Glad to see someone else enjoying Mario Golf. Oh, yeah. I'm going to have to check that out because, like, some people asked me if I was going to play it, and I'm like, well, it's a golf game. That sounds boring. But apparently people are really liking it, so I'm going to have to check it out. So I will go back and watch the VODs and see what y'all think about it. Okay, I think that's all I want to save. Maybe this. Mmm... We'll save this one, too, because that's cute. Or no, hold on. Let's do... Let's see what we got. Hold on. Yeah. No. Oh, gross. Excuse me. We'll do that one. That's not the best picture, but we'll save it for now. <clears throat> Let's go Eevee is the best. It, it was really fun. I didn't expect to like it as much as I did. But yeah, I really had fun with it. Return to camp. Yep. Have we unlocked a new park yet? Is that a thing? I love this game in a healthy amount. Yeah, it's super cute. OMG, yes, WB, let's go Togepi. <laughs> yes, would have me so hyped. Can you imagine how cute that would be? God. <gasps> Wait, what's happening? I love the lab here like it's just i want it i want to live there todd looking so handsome and i'm pretty sure my husband has drawn fan art on his uh instagram it's been a while back i think you know like when this game first came out but i'm pretty sure because my husband likes to corrupt everything and make it sexy uh he did some sexy fan art of todd who is of age he's in his 30s i think at this point so Mm -mm -mm. He's a professional Pokemon photographer. His work takes him all over the world. Are you the one who caught an Illumina Pokemon on the camera? Or on camera? <laughs> Way to go. That's a big deal. Todd, did you bring what I asked you to? Oh. I sure did. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. You're a lifesaver. Now we'll finally be able to set out. Um, mm -mm -mm. Togepi is my little BB. I remember... Okay, I remember when I was a kid... And the first Pokemon movie came out, and I went to see it in theaters, like, the first day. And they did 
before the movie, they ran the little short and introduced Togepi and Snubble. Girl, when I tell you, little, like, 11-year-old me or whatever it was, my wig was snatched right off my head. Uh, I was just so excited. Let's see. As a photographer, the requirements for the four-star photos in this game drive me bonkers. Oh, I bet. Yeah. I'm sure it's hard getting some of these, uh, all of the four stars. <clears throat> Mario Golf has been fun. I didn't expect to enjoy it, uh, to be fair. Yeah. It does not seem like something that I would be interested in, like any of the Mario sports games. I think we have some, but they literally just collect dust because sports are boring to me. Um, <clears throat> is this guy a friend of yours, Professor? But yeah, I've heard really good things about Mario Golf. An old travel companion, to be precise. Sure. Sure, Professor. An old travel companion. He's been helping me plan our big survey of lentil, too. No kidding. Ooh, is that the new pod you put together? Reminds me of the good old days. But hey, let me see those Illumina Pokemon photos. Gotta play more silver stat. I'm slacking. Yeah, I haven't gone... I need to go back and play some of the older games. It's been a while since I've played some. Who is this dick? What a nerd. Can we push him down? Can we throw an apple at his face? Or a fluff fruit at his face? I do kind of like the jacket, though. So you're the new teammate, huh? I'm Phil, Todd's number one student. What a dork. Easy there, Phil. I'm tempted to take part in this big ecological survey myself, but I have another idea. How about I send Phil with you and sit? Can you come with me? I don't want Phil to come with me. Yep. I'm fine with that if you are, Todd. Gross. Whatever. They're fighting over Todd. For real. I mean, I can see why. He, he pretty cute. Uh, da, 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 da. She's awake. We just got home from dinner out together. And then we drove through Snowflake in a lightning storm looking for aliens. It's been a really good day. Thank you for asking. Aw, well, good. That sounds like a lovely day. Driving, driving through a storm can be terrifying or it can be cool. Especially if you're looking for aliens. Uh, your husband has silly levels of talented. Please remind him constantly. Seriously. Oh, I do. Oh, while we're on the subject, look at this new start screen he made. I'm so excited. He drew this all this afternoon after he got home from work. Uh, I'm going to switch to it now. You should still be able to hear me, though. But look how cute that is. Is that not adorable? I love it so much. And, like, paired with the right music. It's so cute. Okay. So we are going to switch back. All right. Okay, we are back. Okay, I had to make sure my my microphone was still working. <clears throat> uh, it's so cute. That's so cool. I love it. I love it. OMG, he did such a great job. So talented. Thank you so much. Like, I, I love his art. It makes me so happy. And I'm so thankful that he can do this stuff for our channel because, like, I have no artistic talent whatsoever, so I am thankful that he can do all that. Uh, okay. Awesome. You can be my stand-in for now, but don't forget, I'll need that badge back. Ooh! Look at him being a poser. That's not even his badge. Ooh, little bitch. Aw, uh. oh, fine. But if I take super cool photo... Wait, if I take a super cool photo, I get to keep the badge. So yeah, what's an ecological survey? Well done on hitting 202 now, Homestead. Oh, nice. Congratulations, Nintendo Gamer. Or wait, uh, Homestead Hero. Oh, excuse me. Congrats, Homestead. Over 200. Very cool. Phil is such a little shit. Oh, is this a person I'm not going to, to like working with? I, I already feel like I'm going to hate them, so. Redeemed Hydrate. Thank you, Nintendo Gamer. I appreciate it. And also, do you want to be addressed as Nintendo Gamer, or uh, is there something else you would prefer? What's well, so good? Thank you. Yes, I was very, I was stunned that he was able to pull that together, like, while I took a nap. <laughs> okay. Now that you're all here, we can get started. Listen up, team. I'm going to give you a breakdown of the survey. Now then. 
This is Florio Island, our home sweet home, and the circled spot right here is our camp. But this survey will take us past these shores. Yes, this will be our first destination. Okay, so we unlocked a new map. Sweet. Founder Jungle. Why are we starting there? I've detected a spot there with high energy readings. The Neo One should be able to teleport to it. This island showed up in the travelogue, right? It certainly did. Captain Benz wrote what he saw, or that he saw a glowing Pokemon there too, in fact. Come on already. Let's get this survey thing started. Fair enough. Why does Pokemon always have to introduce some annoying ass character? Like, why? In every single one. Enjoy your first in a century adventure into the wilds of Lentil. Okay, I'll probably won't focus on chat for a sec because this will be a new map and this is my first time. So I'm sure we're gonna take some horrible pictures and be overwhelmed, but it's okay. Okay, research on Baloo Silver, oh, Baloo Silva Island awaits. Scan should come in handy in that dense jungle. Okay. Okay, so this is where we're headed to. Found a jungle, right? Okay. The sweet scent of fruits and plants envelops this verdant jungle. Okay. Jungle during the day. After each... Okay, we are new to that. Okay, let's see what we got here. <gasps> I, what are they called? Apple, apple ones? Apple? Hold on. I can't remember what they're called. Oh, Bound Sweet. Oh, that's not the apple. The dragon that looks like an apple. It's like the tiniest little dragon Pokemon. Mm. I love A-Palms and Ambi-Palms. I know I'm probably not going to get great pictures the first time through. Because I'm just trying to... Hold on. Oh! Oh! Oh, no, no, no. Wrong button. What do I need to see? Show me, show me, show me. Oh. Nothing? Okay. Woo! <gasps> Look at the beautiful Such a cute baby. Let's hit it. And this is so the first time you go through these maps it's so overwhelming because there's just so much and you turn so slowly oh no I didn't mean to do that again ooh oh I'm missing so many things look at that baby oh I am really taking out my aggressions on Beautiful Eye. Okay. Oh, look at the baby. Here. No, 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 no. Oh, bollocks. over there. Oh, that's the, the woodpecker. Pick a peck. Pick a peck. Oh, sweet. Ancient ruins. Oops. Is there going to be unknowns? Look how pretty! It's oh, so pretty. These maps are so gorgeous. Like, hold on, let's see if I can hit it. Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! 
Okay, well. Shut up, Phil. Oh, I always think to throw the apples too late. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, no. Ah, oh, I shouldn't have thrown the second one. So many things. Look how regal and angry. Mm. Come on. This area is so pretty. <gasps> ah, terrible. It's completely obscured. Almost at the end of the course. Ooh, what's in there? Coax it out. Come on. There's got to be something in that cave that you can, like, coax out. Has to be. Um, Pokemon, uh, Pokemon, you gotta have a little bitch to beat down later. I still need to go back and play this game. It's such a cute game. Yes, I'm loving it so far. Did you ever get your ice cream? I did not, unfortunately. <laughs> I wanted ice cream all day. I did get Taco Bell today, so I was happy about that. I felt like I needed it. It was a rough day. I really want Pokemon Stadium to come back to Switch. Yes, can you imagine how cool that would be on the Switch? I mean, I know a lot of people don't want them to keep like remaking things, but at this point, there's so many cool Pokemon. It would be incredible. Uh, mm -mm -mm. Uh, I didn't have a pretty big... Wait, hold on, I missed something. Did you snag... Oh, I get called Nintendo, Nintendo Gamer, Al, Alex, Allie. <laughs> you can call me whatever you want. Okay, cool. Alright. I have a terrible memory, so I'm just gonna stick with Nintendo Gamer. Uh, we'll go with that. <laughs> um, thank you for the lurk, Ryan. I appreciate it. I feel like you always do, but so do I. I don't like... Oh, like, my backlog right now is so... Massive. And I just keep buying more games. I don't know what I'm doing, but I just, if it's on sale, I'm like, I have to buy this. And then it just goes in the pile and I never get to it. But we're working on that. Uh, oh my God, that would be amazing. I remember that, yes, 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 yes. Mm -mm. Wait, my dream is to own a Blockbuster N64 Pokemon Stadium cabinet. Oh, yeah. I forgot all about those. Isn't that where you could go and, like, print off your little pictures and stuff? I feel like I did that a few times. I have a ton of games. I need to look up a picture of that to, like, refresh it in my memory. I have a ton of games, but there are also a few others I need to really snag soon, so I gotta make room in my heart for more. I know, and now I'm looking at Monster Hunter Stories 2. Don't need it, right? I've never seen the first one. Um, Lilo and Switch, who was in here earlier, was playing uh, the new one today. Um... I need to watch it. I've never seen it before. Like, any gameplay from it before. Is that, is that all I got, really? Those are all terrible. Should I go with the multiple or the flying? I think I'm going to go with this one. Just because I threw something at it and aggravated it. Um... I think they do. I remember being able to get... Yeah, I was pretty sure you could, like, uh, go to um, Blockbuster and get a photo. What is this? Apom. Oh, man. I got some really terrible shots of Apom. We'll do better. We'll do better. Look at this one, like, right up on us. I think this one is probably the best, maybe? I don't know. I like, th I, there are others that definitely look better, but I think what it's looking for, I think, would be this, maybe. And I know we got a decent one of this one eating, so let's look for that. Here? There we go. That's probably the best. 
Quagsire looking derpy as always. Love and life. I wish I could be as free as Quagsire. Mm -mm. I need to go and make breakfast for small boy and his sister. I'll look for a while. Uh, love you, my faraway friend. Take care. Thank you so much for hanging out and, and dropping the lurk. Enjoy, um, enjoy making breakfast. I know you'll make something delicious. Yes, thank you for the shout out for Muesli Bodermum. If you're not following Muesli and you're into games like Stardew Valley and Cozy Grove and uh, Graveyard Keeper, um, please go give them a follow. She's very sweet, very uh, calming to listen to, very soothing. Wonderful person. Ooh, my tummy. I am hungry. You stick to whatever, uh, glad to catch you this morning here in the UK. Oh, well, thank you. I am glad that you're here, able to catch some of the stream. I know I, I stream at a weird time for the US, so a lot of people that join in on the stream are either night owls here from the US or people from overseas because it's already daytime over there, so. Uh, I think that one's the cutest, but there's also that one, like, facing the camera head on. This one. I think we're gonna go with this because it's closer. Oh, I can't, okay, I can't submit that. That's right. Like Pokemon Pearl and Diamond, uh, I still go back and forth on which one to get. I mean, don't you need both? When I was a kid, I insisted on having both. Like, I was poor, but I made sure that like my brother got one version and I got the other version. Like we, I was not about to share. I don't even think you could share. I, I think you could just have one file at the time. It's been so long since I played, I don't really remember. Bon sweet. Two copper stars, not bad, but you know, we'll do much better. This is our first run, so not gonna be great. Mm -mm -mm. Again, sorry for the doggo snores. The dogs are right outside the door. Well, one of them's in here behind the green screen, and the other is right outside the door snoring, so. You might hear that occasionally. Look at those big old eyes. Evelyn talked about how fun your stream was all day, by the way. She FaceTimed her best friend and even talked about you. Aw, that's so sweet. I'm glad that she likes me. <laughs> I mean, that's very sweet of her. That was definitely a dark game. And I don't know if you... I don't I don't remember if you were around for the ending, but it was very sad. And today, thinking back on it, I was even more sad. Because I was like, I hope that little girl found her eternal happiness because she deserved it and so, it was so sweet. Hasiel even texted me after he watched it, and he was like, she would be the perfect daughter for us. <laughs> okay, I got a gold star. I thought that'd be a little bit better, but okay. Yes, oh, yeah. It Like, that game was so heartbreaking, because that little girl was so sweet. It hurt my heart. And I started watching somebody else's stream. I watched this, um, there's a YouTuber I watched named Jazzy Guns, and she's hilarious. Um, but she had done a playthrough for it, of it, and I was watching her, and she was choosing the exact opposites of everything that I had chosen, so it was interesting to see how things played out. I, had, I didn't get very far into it before I fell asleep, because I was really tired, but... Speed through these, because I want to play again. A new discovery. I feel like this one should get a decent score. Okay, good. Diamond Star. Very nice, very nice. It's interesting how, like, for every map, and I think time of day there are different levels so I feel like you would just have like a collective level 
but I, I, I guess not. Lentil research team, you researched uh, Belu Silva Island for the first time. You receive the research title, Lentil Research Team. Okay, Fluff Fruit. You got a sticker, Fluff Fruit. Okay. By the way, if you like, I can start start uploading standout photos for you. They deserve to be seen widely. Uh, I don't know about that. Photos I upload will be added to your collection online. On your page, they'll be marked as my favorites. You change whether you'd like me to do this by going to the settings and turning auto upload photos on or off. Okay, I don't want that on. I don't want that on. Save photos to album. Uh, I guess I'll save that. Save a couple. I kind of like that one. I know none of these are really like worthy of, of saving, but I'm gonna save that one. And I love pictures of Pokemon sleeping, so we're gonna go with this. And then also this. Looking all sassy. Like, WTF are you doing in our jungle? Okay. Let's go back and return to camp. Wait, retry menu. What is that? Research the same. Oh, okay. Yeah, let's do that. I want to do it again. Without having to go back to the camp. Hee. Chair's all squeaky. I'm getting hungry again, of course. It's been a while since I had that taco bell. Need more tacos. Tacos y burritos. Something up in that tree. Spider Pokemon, like Ariados. Oh. Huh. I wonder if it comes out at night. Nope. Terrible. Oh, oh, an Arbok. Can we get it to come over here? Feels like I'm not doing much better this <laughs> this run through. Always gotta do better. Oh, there's our butt. Okay. Oh! Look over here, buddy. Ooh. What's he attacking? Oh man, I hate that I'm missing that. Whatever's happening over there. Posing. Yes. Cute. I don't know why I keep like craning my neck upwards like it's gonna help with the camera view. That must be like a nighttime Pokemon. Can we throw anything in there? What is it? What is it? What is it? Oh, it's a pick a pack. Okay. I think. Okay, no. That didn't help. <gasps> the water is so pretty. Everything in this game is so pretty. Very much enamored with the graphics. So, such a wild difference from the 64 version, of course. I don't know why I did that there. Okay, let's try to look at the other areas of the island that we missed the first time through. 
Ugh, always obscured. It's like trying to get pictures of Bigfoot. No. Ooh. I probably didn't get the picture that I wanted. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, I should have. That would have been a cute picture. I didn't know it was going to jump in. Oh, there's a magic heart. Oh, come on, you big derpy baby. There's got to be a way to coax it out, right? No. Can't be bothered. No, don't. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. Ah, uh, I wish I could have gotten that shot of it um, diving in. Because that, that would have been an action shot, and there would have been two in the picture. Ugh, oh well. No. Nope. Terrible. Just lurking whilst I have breakfast. Alright, no worries. Thank you for the lurk. Enjoy your breakfast. Uh, do, do, do. Posted a photo of the Pokemon Stadium cabinet in your Discord. Oh yeah, thank you for joining our Discord. I appreciate that. It's so ugly. Uh, dream upon dreams to own my own. It's so ugly, but I love her. <laughs> I do that too with my neck. Or like I start... Uh, oh, start to the left and the right. Yeah. There are so many times, like, especially when I'm playing Mario Kart, I, like, lean my body like it's going to do something. And then, uh, yeah, with games like this, I, like, look up in the sky like it's going to do something. <laughs> like I can control the camera with my head. Yes, speaking of our Discord, if there are any lurkers that would like to join, feel free, but no pressure. It's small, and we don't talk a whole, whole lot, but we're trying to start using it more. Getting the hang of this course, aren't you? Why don't you pick up some photos to show me? <laughs> Excuse me, goodness. Okay, pick a pick. Um, I didn't really get a better one, so we're just gonna leave that. Why is it? Yeah, none of these are better. I'll just leave that. Hmm. Should I do the waving or the eating? I'm gonna do the waving. Did I get any good ones of Arbok? It was pretty much behind that tree the whole time. I guess there's like that one decent one. It's gonna have to do for now. Beautify. I feel like I got. That was okay. We'll, we'll do that. This has to be better. Hmm. I don't know, I feel like this one's closer. I'm gonna go with that. And, okay. Those are really far off, but we're gonna try to submit it anyway. Yes. Do you have Pokemon Shield? Yes, um, I have, uh, I believe I have Shield and Hasiel has Sword, I think. Um, like I was talking to Matt earlier, I don't have the DLC, um, but I have beaten, like, the base game, but I need to get the DLC. Nice work. Nice. Okay, we got two diamond stars for that one. Good. Good, good, good. We'd love to see it. Uh, this one's essentially the same. Maybe even a little worse, because it's a little bit further off. Oh, okay. Wow, alright. We'll take it. Striking backgrounds. Okay, that does make a difference then. Uh, we'll keep this one. 
Got a diamond star on that one. A new discovery. Nice work. Terrible. You did a terrible job, Joshua. Uh, oh, nice. We have shield. I didn't realize there was... Oh, yeah, there is DLC. And uh, the DLC, I believe, is different uh, depending on which version you have. Um, I know one is like a s snowy mountain region, I think. I don't remember what the other one is, though. Um, but, yeah, I wish that there was a way to, like, get both. But uh, I'll watch Hossie. I'll play his DLC, and I'll play my DLC. I see it's in flight. Nice going. Okay. Oh, nice. We did a little bit better that time then. Okay. So we'll go with that one. Replace our original. Nice work. Is this going to be any better? Mm, no. Okay, so essentially the same. Yeah. We'll just keep that then. Clementine! Thank you for the host. Very much appreciated. Oof, awful. So bad. Nice work. Nintendo Gamer, thank you for the host. I appreciate you all very much. Okay, that's essentially the same, so we're going to go with this one because I like it better. It looks sassier. Alright, I'll probably have to play through it one more time and then unlock the nighttime. Oh, yeah, one more time and then we'll unlock the nighttime, I think. Seeing you at work reminds me of Todd in the old days. Keep it up. Mm, I don't think there's any of those that were like worthy of saving, really. Yeah, none of these are really. Nah, we're good thought I'd host. Well, thank you. It is always appreciated. Return. Uh, we're going to retry one more time, because that should unlock the night version, I think. Hope your breakfast is going well. I'm getting hungry myself. I should eat something. I don't know what that is. I want to figure out how to get better pictures of the R box. Dang. Oh, I almost got its face. Oh no, that would have been so cute. like we're getting better. That Arbok is paying no attention. I don't know what it's attacking over there. Oh. Is that one I'm going to point out? Oh. Is this a stupid crystal bloom? Yes. Why does it keep showing us that? I don't understand. Like, we see... Okay, also... Can we hit it? Come on. It is angry. Big man. I keep looking up in the trees. Come on, baby. I hate... I feel so bad hitting them. 
Oh yes, serve. Serve. Give us those action shots. I think it's just gonna show us the fruit again. Oh, oh. Are these? <gasps> so cute. Feel bad bugging them, but you know what? It's a game, so <laughs> they're fine. So, my Joy-Con is not wanting to be super reactive when I try to move it. So cute. I feel like I've gotten a few good pictures of pick a pack, so like I'm not really sure. I wish you could submit multiples, but I know that you can't. But it's fine. No, put it in front of me next time. Ooh, that's a good shot. Ooh, they look so angry. Yes. Adrian, hello, hello, friend. What is up? I love that you are craning your neck as if it would help you look for Pokemon. I was just mentioning that a few minutes ago. I don't know why in my brain I keep thinking that I can adjust the camera by, like, craning my neck upwards, but it, it just happens. I don't know. It's so weird. I can't stop myself from doing it. How's it going, Drian? How was your stream? What were you streaming tonight? I, I feel like you were starting a new story game, right? Let's see... Uh, Oxen pretty. Ooh, I feel like I've heard that name before, but I don't know anything about the game. But I hope you enjoyed it. How did it go? Y'all should follow Drian Lavode. They are fantastic, wonderful person, um, very sweet, loving community, um, very supportive community. Uh, they love The Walking Dead. Uh, they play Horizon Zero Dawn. They've played Hob, which I want to play. Um, they've play they play a lot of story driven games. They were playing GTA Five the other day. They play Conan Exiles, which me and Hasiel turned around and purchased because of them. So please drop them a follow if I have any lurkers out there who are not following them. Okay, yeah, I feel like I got some decent shots of this. See, I got this like. I feel like this action shot would be good, but then I also got some really close-up ones. I'm gonna go with this. Uh, LMAO, I did the same thing, looking for survivors, killers, and DPS. Oh yeah, I, I have noticed that while watching you play. Yeah, you're very much like this, <laughs> so... So yeah, I'm glad I'm not the only person. It's really good so far, about halfway through it. It's from Night School stu Studios, who have several former Telltale creators working there. Some of the same voice actors as well. Nice! What type of a game is it? Is it like a horror game? Or is it like a, a game where you make choices? Or what What type of thing is it? The story, the characters, the art, all good so far. Nice! I'll have to go back and watch your VOD. Uh, I'm always looking for like new cool games to check out. 
I bet whoever created VR gaming um, headsets had the same experience as us moving our necks around as if that would help in the game. That is true. That is one place where it comes in, in handy is in VR. Man, I need to play some VR. Like, I always go back to the same titles, like the um, the Until Dawn Rush of Blood one where you're on the roller coaster is one of my favorite things ever. <laughs> it's so fun. Okay, I really like this one, so we're gonna go with that. Arbuck, we didn't get a good one, but I'm gonna submit it anyway just because it's it takes up a lot of the photo, so we're gonna see what that gets us. And we got some pictures of Magikarp eating. Finally. This one looks so stupid, I love it. It's like it's like a roast pig, but like a Magikarp. <laughs> I'm totally gonna do that. Uh Quagsire. Yes, we should have gotten I think we got some decent ones of that. Look at that adorable little yawn. Okay. I'm gonna go that. Oxen Free is a dialogue heavy time dialogue option story game with creepy theme to it. Beautiful art on the setting and set. Ooh, okay. Yeah, I will definitely go back and watch your um your video of it. Oh, we got some really good ones near the end. This one looking so pissed off. It did not want us there. At all. We're gonna go with this one. Okay. Yes. Same studio did After Party, which is more of a comedy, not creepy. Okay. Interesting. I've never heard of that company before, but I will check them out. I see you snapped this just as it was pecking at a tree. Great timing. Okay, awesome. Hopefully that'll get us some good points. No, it did not. Oh, it did. Okay, three diamond stars. Yes. Very nice. Okay. I'm happy with that. Uh, I don't think this one's going to be because it's too far away, but we'll see. Oh, okay. So it went up a little bit. We got uh, upgraded to a diamond star. We'll take it. If you decide to play any of them yourself, you should go for After Party. I think you would have a good time with the irreverent sense of humor. Probably. And I do have a very uh, odd sense of humor. <laughs> I like dark things. So, um, yes, I will check into that one. I'll at least watch the trailer and see what what's up with it. Uh, also... I didn't think about it until this evening as I was like watching another YouTube video, but I still haven't gone back and watched your um, your music videos for season two of The Walking Dead yet, but I am going to do that tomorrow because uh, I had completely forgotten about it. And then as I got on YouTube, I remembered. So yes, it's set in hell and it's funny. Oh my God. Yes. That sounds totally up my alley. I am down to check that out. Okay, so even though it's not facing the camera, we still did significantly better, so we'll take that. It's having a nice meal. Okay, got a three-star one then. Very nice. It's a tad unusual. Okay. This is fairly common behavior. Perfect timing. Perfect timing. Huh. Okay, so we went down. So we'll go with the original on that. Even though it's real basic. But okay, we'll, we'll go with that. This is the higher score. This has to be better, right? Man. No? About the same. Okay. Well, I like that one better, so I'm going to save that one. I think we should be able to unlock the night playthrough. 
Yes, level up. Okay. Another step forward for our research. I bet Pokemon in the area are getting comfortable with you. By the way, thanks to the progress you've made in your research, I've got something to report. I'll fill you in once your photos are squared away. I think you'll be pleased to hear this. <clears throat> uh, yeah, I'll save a couple of those. Some of them were kind of cute and some were kind of derpy. Mm. I'm gonna save that one. Chow time. And... I also think this one is really cute, even if the professor didn't. The dick. And which one? This one. I want to save that one. Okay, return to camp. Hmm. So many doggy snores in the background. All right. Looks like you're finding your feet on a new island. Now. It's about time I give you your next task. What? Ooh, what is it? What is it? I'd like you to visit the jungle during the night and photograph a crystal bloom glowing in the dark. Huh? What's a crystal bloom? Oh, um... It's a type of flower that can give off light. Do you remember seeing any odd flowers out there? Uh, yes, you've been yeah. very in my face about it. Red ones, okay. If you see one lit up at night, it's in what we call the Illumina state. Do we need to do anything special if we find one? Not particularly, just snap a photo of it. Your camera can analyze it for you. Thanks. That should be all you need to know for now. Enjoy the nighttime jungle. All right, so because there's going to be different Pokemon out, I will once again be overwhelmed, but it's fine. We're gonna replay it two or three times, so we'll get the shots. Uh, which is human all year long. It's mostly covered by a forest, as I'm sure you've noticed. Yes. Okay. Let's do it! it off real good. I still keep craning my neck. <laughs> Why am I so weird? <gasps> Ooh, it's Ariados. Yes. Empty web. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. How do I get Ariados to drop down? Awesome. Why is it not analyzing it? That's weird. Snap some photos of it, which we should be good. More long. Oh. Pretty. Okay. How do we get that Ariados to come out? Oh my goodness, they look so cute. 
The baby's just sleeping. Closer. Give me them spider babies. Joltik is one of my favorites. Super cute. I have one named Blueberry. Because it reminds me of Blueberry Lemonade. Ooh, so many. Okay. Oh, come on now. Wake him up. Oh, what was that? Ancient ruins. Is there anything out there? Come on. I forgot that those were down there. Hmm. I know one of those toucans. Or toucan, uh... I think it's just called Toucan. It's out here somewhere. More magic heart. <gasps> mm. No. Oh, yes. Yon Mega. Multiple Yon Megas. Oh, oh love it. Oh, yes. Come on. Get all the good picks. Is it gonna eat me? Oh wait, no, it's not even facing me. It doesn't care. Look how cute! Oh my god! Oh no, I knocked it over. So when they release the spores, they pass out. We didn't do great, but we didn't do terribly, so. Hello. Okay, I don't think we got, yeah, we definitely didn't get a good one in Bond Suite. I'll submit this one, but I don't think... Hmm. I'll submit that one, but I don't think it's any better. We got some decent ones of Ariados. I think they were kind of far away. There we go. That one's pretty, pretty good. Two cannon. Okay, I don't even see it in this picture. But apparently it's there, so we're going to submit it just so we have it. Oh. The subject is not clearly... Okay. Fine. Look at it. Nomin on that fluff fruit. So cute. I love Yanma and Yan Megas. Especially the shiny versions. Look at him just grooving. That sweet baby. Okay. Okay, that one. And more lol. I feel like this one's gonna be difficult because like I got I think I got a few cute ones. But then again, you know, I might not have, so. Cause like I like that one. I like this one where it's releasing spores, so that might count. Maybe that counts as something special. 
them like releasing the spores. I think I'll submit that one because it's like an action shot and it has multiples and they're centered. So we're gonna go with that. Ugh, I hate that I didn't get a better one of uh, Ladian, Ladian, however you say it. Ladyba. Uh, I don't, there's no reason to submit that one, but. Okay. There we go. All right, let's see what he says. I do really like the background of that one, like it, up in the tree, like looking down with the, the stars in the background and the, the jungle. It's very nice. Two s diamond stars, very nice. I'm learning so many Pokemon names with this game there. Oh yeah, that's what I was saying at the beginning. Um, you know, I've, I've been a Pokemon fan since the very start, but at this point there's almost a thousand Pokemon and it's some... You know, I've played most of the games, but there are some that I've never come across, and I'm just like, what is that? So, yeah, same here. And a lot of times, like, in the games, you don't hear how they're pronounced. So, I, like, Ladian, I don't know how to say that properly. I've always seen it in games, but I have no idea how to actually pronounce it properly. So, probably making a fool out of myself. Nice, two diamond stars right off the bat. Nice work. Looks like it's fast asleep. Okay. Excuse me. Three diamond stars, yes. More lol. When I get home, I'll show you my Pokemon guidebook from when I was a kid versus Evelyn's. It's wild. Mine is the same size as her legendary Pokemon guide alone. Oh, yeah, I bet. Yeah, it's, you know, and I remember, I don't know why, but when I was a kid, and we, you know, we had the first 151, and I was, like, an expert on it. I had my little GeoCities website where I had made, like, discussions for every single Pokemon, and I posted pictures of every single one of them, and, um... And then when they started introducing the new ones, like, the next generation, I was like, no, there's only 151 Pokemon. I mean, in this whole world, they've seen other other areas, and there's not any more Pokemon. There are only 151. I don't accept these new Pokemon. They're not real. And so for the longest time, I did not play the new, the game, the second generation when it came out, um, because I was like very much against it for some reason and i don't know why but i'm glad i came around <laughs> hard same though okay so i wasn't the only weirdo i was like i don't accept this looks like it's been bopped by something nice going that's a terrible photo Hey, it got us two stars, so, okay, we'll go with it. Uh, I don't even know why I submitted this one. Crystal Bloom. This is the Belu Silva Island Crystal Bloom, or Crista Bloom. Uh, this is the first time we photograph one in the Illumina state. All right. Oh, they don't grade those. Okay. Huh. I guess that's just, like, specialty research or something? We're just getting started with this after-hours research. Good luck out there. I know you can do it. Alright. We're gonna do it another time. You've registered seven species of bug-type Pokemon to your photo decks. Uh, you registered the Crystal Bloom to your photo decks. By the way, now that we've got that Crystal Bloom info, I've got something to report. 
I hope you're excited. I am so excited. Um, let's see if there were any worth saving. I do kind of like that picture, so I'm going to save that. And then maybe one of the quagsires. I also really like that Yan Mega picture, so we're going to go with that. baby asleep. The moose has been riled, so uh, if you hear a large creature moving around me, that's what that is. I started to accept some here and there, like Togepi and Meryl for whatever. Yeah, yeah, same. Togepi, I was sold on from the very beginning, because seeing um, Misty just carry it around, and it looks so adorable. Oh, my heart. So yeah, same on that one. <laughs> okay, return to camp. I'm gonna do one more night exploration. And then maybe that will unlock another map. I don't know, I'm not really sure how much you have to do to like unlock the next map. I totally forgot to get me. Oh! Oh, wait, no, I didn't. Never mind. I was gonna say, I forgot to refresh my green tea when I went in there, but I've already drank it. I didn't forget. Great job. Your photos gave us plenty of data to work with. I've got something new to show you. Take a look. I'm struggling to read. Oh, are those the orb thingies you've been working on, Professor? I, why? I am reading like <laughs> a second grader or something. <laughs> Those gigantic staring eyes. Which one? Oh, yeah. Are you talking about uh, Rita? Because, yeah, they're really, like, piercing into us. Didn't you say they could make Pokemon and Krista Bloom's glow? Oh. Huh. So that's how we, like, activate them. Okay, exactly. I call them Illumina Orbs. Yeah, they've got some intense stares. Unfortunately, blue Illumina Orbs only work here on Florio Island. Florio Island, whatever. What? How come? I suspect it's because different areas of Lentil have distinct types of energy flowing through them. But for now, want to see the fruits of your research in action? Yes. Watch this. You know I do. Nice. That was awesome. But what does it do? Does it make the... Like, does it make the Pokemon around them act differently or something? Lentil's own, very own light show. What did you call it again? The Illumina Phenomenon? It's interesting how it can occur in both Pokemon and plants. You can use these orbs to send Pokemon and Crystal Blooms into the Illumina state for a little while. Okay, cool. I wonder if that works on all Pokemon or just certain ones. When you do, watch for changes in their surroundings. Can we have some of the orbs that work here on Florio? Of course you can. We're gonna have to try these out back at the nature park. I mean, him too, really. Uh, when people are looking at you, you don't typically see the whites of their eyes above their iris unless they are widening their... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and they're like, really hardcore staring. Plus the oval irises. These people are not human. Oh, yeah. No. They are not. Um, okay. Illumina Orb Yellow. I have to go now. Got work very soon. Well, have a wonderful day at work. Thank you so much for lurking and hanging out for a while. Uh, I will do my best to catch your next stream. And uh, yeah, let me do you another shout out. I don't know if I have many people who are actually hanging around. I think I, most people are lurking or asleep by this, this point, but... Um, but yes, have a wonderful day, and I hope you get to feeling better. I know you said you were kind of feeling a little sickly. But thanks for having me, and have a great stream. Thank you so much. You are very sweet. Have a great day. Thank you for the shot. Oh, no worries. Of course.
New request? Wait, new request. Or new research. I don't know. All of our things on screen are blocking some of the, the things. We really need to set up both of our monitors. Um, maybe I can do that on Wednesday. Yeah, we're gonna go research a bunch of spots. Let's see who can take better photos. Okay. I think they said we had to go back to the nature part to try these out, though. They didn't really t tell us how to use it, though. Hold on. One sec. Hmm. Maybe it'll just tell us once we start going through the park. Uh, let's do night because they gave us the Illumina holes. Because, like, she didn't even, like, tell us how to throw them or anything, so... Usually they give us a little bit of a tutorial. We might discover something new here. Okay. So cute. Murkrow, and I really wish I could see a haunt crow, but they don't really seem to care. I'm running a scan. Noises are coming from unnatural. Okay. Oh! There we go. Okay. Sweet. sleeping. And it looks so peaceful. Aww. Yeah, he doesn't seem to be having it. Yeah, none of the the birds don't really seem to care much about the, uh... Oh! Nope! Spoke too soon. <gasps> so pretty! What? What am I supposed to see? Oh, okay. Careful or you'll run out of memory. Okay. Whoops. <gasps> oh my goodness. Look at Sylveon. Oh my god. Oh. Wow. Okay, so Magikarp's just vibing. I've only got three pictures left. I gotta be careful. What if I see something incredible and don't have any film? Left. 
Oh, look how happy. <gasps> What's that? What was that? Oh no! Oh, I'm a fool! What a fool I've been! Oh, I took too many pictures. I got overly excited. Okay, I'm definitely doing that again. Look at our baby Sylvia. We got to see a lot of Pokemon this time, too. We did. I love it. I do think I'm going to rate these, uh, and then I think I'm going to take a be right back. I'm going to go use the restroom and refill my drink. Uh, I do think I'm going to play for another hour or so, because I'm really enjoying this game. And this is my last night of streaming, unfortunately, because i got to go back to work tomorrow night. Um, but yes, I do want to play more of this. Even if no one is around to watch, I want to play. Let's see... That's a cool shot. Yeah, let's go with that. Do I want the picture? No, it's too far away. <clears throat> Excuse me. My borps. That one's kind of obscured, but it's eating, and it's closer up, so we'll try it. It looks so derpy, but it's so cute. Did I get any decent ones of Murkrow? Not really. They're so hard to, like, capture while they're flying. I would love to get a, like, good group shot of them. I don't know. I'm not gonna submit that one. Pinsir, we got an Illumina po pose from them. I wish, okay, so we've got two, two stars. Um, I wish I could see, oh, okay, it does tell us. Okay, so we have a one star, a two star. Do we have anything? No, we don't have any three or four stars. Okay, that makes it convenient. The trio, let's see if we've got anything better of it. Okay, so far we just have a one star. Do we have any, we have a three star. Okay, so let's, it looks very happy and dancing, so we're going to use that one. My mom's dog out in the hallway is snoring so loudly right now. Look at this beautiful, perfect baby. Amazing. I'm not... I, I don't think that I was aware that Magikarp just sleeps on a rock outside at night. Like, that's weird to me. Do we have any? Okay. I feel like we're never gonna get a decent shot of Magikarp. That fish did. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, he, uh, he not much of a fighter. He doesn't have much zest for life. A much more relaxing game for you to unwind with. Oh yeah, truly. Yeah. I needed something like this. <laughs> um, because even last night, like, I was really happy that we played the game uh, we did last night. It was called Little Misfortune, and it was so cute. Like, I love the art style, and the voice acting was so adorable. And the humor was hilarious, but uh, underneath it all, it had a really sad, depressing story. Um, but it was, I'm still very happy that we played it, because it was so cute. Um, no, this isn't a good one. I mean, I'll submit it, but there's not really any reason to. Um, I guess we'll do that one. But 
Yes. Scorbunny. That's a three star photo. Yes. When you see a flaming kick like that, you know it's Score Bunny. Fantastic. You captured exactly the right moment. Sweet. Three gold stars. We will take it. Okay, two silver stars, not bad. I feel like this is a better photo, in my opinion, anyway. We'll see. Yes, okay, good. Go with that one. Murkrow. God, I can't, like, I hope there's a Honchkrow, because I love Honchkrow. It's one of my favorites. Um... Okay, so we did a little bit better. Another streamer friend of mine decided to find pretty and relaxing game to play after The Walking Dead, something to just chill with. They picked up the small obscure game, or they picked up a small obscure game, which started off really pretty, but turned out super sad. There are some games that sneak up on you like that. Yeah, yeah, that's kind of how this one was, because by the end of it, I was like, oh no, I see where this is going. And I mean, you're told from the beginning what's going to happen, but still, I was very, um, I was, I was a little down, but it's okay. It was still a very cute game. Next is Pinsir, very imposing. Yeah, sometimes, uh, like you said, sometimes they sneak up on you and you're not expecting it. You're like, oh, this is going to be adorable. I remember, like, Ori in the Blind Forest is like that. You, like, start it, and it's you think it's going to be this beautiful game, and then you're like, oh, oh, this is sad. Much better. Great timing. Three diamond stars. Yes. Ah, oh, beautiful. Stunning. So good with that one, I guess. Combi. I don't even know why I submitted this one. Oh, okay. So that is different. Interesting. Yeah, chat was very upset uh, by that when I streamed the first Ori game. <laughs> yeah, because, like... I just went because, like, I saw the trailer for it and saw, like, the beautiful artwork and the music and everything, and I was like, oh man, this looks like a beautiful, chill game. I was very wrong. Uh, not only was it sad, but um, it was incredibly difficult, so much so that during my second stream of it, I rage quit and I never finished it, so. <laughs> Let's see. Um, I've watched other friends play it, though, and it's a beautiful game. Both of them. Your photos get better and better. I'll make sure our research keeps up with your progress. Dam completed. You discovered a route that leads over Beedoof's Dam. Ooh! Oh, so you get, like, different paths that go through the same park? That's cool. Alrighty. I did not know that. You snapped a total of 500 photos. Registered Florio Island Crystal Bloom. Yeah, it's definitely a challenge. Yeah, I was like, I, I was shook because I legit thought it was just going to be like, you know, like a platformer type game, like, you know, have a little bit of a challenge, but there are some really difficult parts in that game, or both of those games. And uh, I've been watching another friend play through Hollow Knight absolutely gorgeous game wonderful music 
super cute, creepy graphics. Um, but it looks so difficult that I am so thankful that I never actually paid for it, like downloaded the game, because I would not have been able to get through it. It looks so hard. Okay, uh, I want to save that. And we're going to save this one because he looks all derpy and cute. That one. And then we're going to save that one of Pinsir, and then we'll be done with those. That form we submitted. Okay, for a little tiny Australian, or miniature Australian Shepherd, she snores like a grown man. It's insane. Okay. Um... Should we retry that one? Yeah, I do want to retry that, because we saw some new Pokemon, and there, there were some I wanted to get better shots of. Okay, I'm going to take a be right back. I really, really, really got to go pee, so I'm going to put on some music. I'm going to turn that down just a bit. Okay, I will be right back, friends. One moment. One sec.
All right, sorry about that. Had to get a quick snack and I didn't want to subject you all to watching me eat or make chewing sounds into the microphone. So we're gonna stop the music and get back to the game. Okay, we've got the mic on and the game audio on. So we should be good to go. Um, we're gonna retry that one. Something was happening in that field that like shot up a light and I don't know what that was, but this time we're gonna save some photos. Come back. Oh, all right. Fine. <laughs> Can I make it angry? Oh. oh, that's poor sleepy baby. So hot girl. <gasps> Look at the baby. Gotta be. Does it want me to see? Yes, yes, yes. Pressing the wrong buttons because, of course, Bit of bitty booty. I wonder how I access the new route. Oh, this is it. Okay. Wait, no, no, it's not. stop myself from craning my neck upwards. Oh, messed that up. I'm really messing this playthrough up. I'm getting nothing accomplished. Oh my tummy. I don't know what I was aiming for there. <gasps> Combies! Look how cute! Light is coming from. The, okay, I'm dumb. <laughs> it's coming from the portal, of course. No. Here, come to me, Gumby. Where did it go? Ugh. Okay, we're not having much luck with that. 
So I wonder if... I think they said we can only use those on this island. submit it, but I don't think it's anything great. Mm. All of these are four star. Okay. So we'll go with, I guess, this one, because it's eating. Yeah. Um, Caterpie. It's about the same. Look, Angie. Hmm. I think I'm gonna go with the one I've been flying. I don't have any of those yet. Wait. Okay, I've got one star, two star. This is a three star. Okay, so we're gonna go with that. Bidoof. We just got Bidoof Booty. No, that's not what I meant to do. Yeah, there's there's no reason to submit that. Oh my goodness, look how cute and happy they look. I love them so much. And Vespiquin is absolutely stunning. This one does not turn into Vespa Quinn, but <gasps> Angela, thank you for the host. Good morning. I hope you're doing well. No, I don't want that. No. Wait. Does that count? I mean, I guess. I'll, I'll submit it. Let's see. I am doing all right. I'm having fun with this game. It's very bright and colorful and happy and seeing all the cute animals is bringing a smile to my face. So, and I'm glad you are doing good. Thank you for joining us, joining us tonight. Oh, it's a bouffalant. Seems brave and bold, doesn't it? Nice work. Um, we'll keep the original. All right, so we got the four star. Four diamonds, nice. Or was that diamonds? I might have missed that. Nice work. Yes. Nice work. New Pokemon Snap is amazing. Yeah, I'm, I'm very much enjoying it. I like it a lot so far. I'm having fun with it. By the way, my birthday is next Tuesday on July 20th. Nice. Well, happy early birthday. Are you, uh, do you have any big plans for your birthday? Do you have, like, a favorite restaurant you're going out to, or, or a favorite type of cake that you're wanting? I know you said you're planning on getting a, or you're hoping to get a Switch and Animal Crossing, so that will be fantastic. I'm very much looking forward to you having your own, uh, Switch and Animal Crossing. Because it's such, such a great console. When you're framing your shot, be careful how you position the Pokemon. Okay. I'm not really sure what big plans I will have. Okay. Well, hopefully you will have a lovely birthday. Seems brave and bold, doesn't it? Uh, yeah, we'll go with the, the glowy one. He looks cool. I see it's in flight. I mean, okay. Oh, that's hard. I think I like this shot better. Even though it's a few less points. Yeah, fewer points, but the picture is cuter. So, we're gonna go with that. I don't even know why I took a picture of here, but it seems to be counting it. I don't... Oh, I guess that. Okay. Alright, I 
kind of want to go back to the other park and try that at night again. Mm, I don't think I got any, like, super... Actually, I did get, um... Let me get that Combi one. I want to save that picture. Nothing else really matters. I really like that one. It's cute. Okay, we turn to camp. Mm -hmm. hey, so I bet Illumina Orbs will help us find new stuff to research on the courses we've visited. Um, I mean, we'll see. I don't, I don't think they'll work on the other island, but I want to try. Okay. Yep. Let's go at night and see if we can use those. I'm, I'm pretty sure it said that we can only use them on that island, but okay. We'll try. Oh. My Tommy is growling. I'm hungry. <laughs> Oh, you get the yellow ones here. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I keep messing up the pictures. Where is Ariados? Differently there. I'm trying to find there's I know there's some new ones that I'm missing. And I still haven't been able to submit a picture of that toucan one yet, but I think that's during the the daytime. Hey, good eye! Now we can get a closer look at those swamp Pokemon. Oh. Oh, okay. Sweet. No, I don't mean to keep doing that. Nope. Okay. Whoa, really? So many more more lols in the trees. Oh, and I think we missed those uh <laughs> the ruins again. There has to be a purpose to those. They wouldn't just have them and point them out. trees.
Ugh. Whatever. Okay. I probably already missed Quag's higher here. Doing all the wrong things. Doing all the wrong things. <laughs> Why? They're so precious. Okay. Well, I didn't do very well, but it's okay. My favorite Pokemon is Meowth. Oh, very nice. Well, that's cool. I'm a fan of Meowth. I dig him. <clears throat> I think he's pretty cool, especially in the cartoon, of course. He's, he's a very fun character. <clears throat> he's really the only part of Team Rocket that ever, like, has a good idea. Ball sweet. Mmm... We'll submit this one, but it's not good. I feel like we got some pretty cute pictures of Marlol. Go with that one. Thanks, fire. About the same. <clears throat> okay. How about you? Um, <clears throat> I have my absolute all time favorite is Bulbasaur. He, my baby. Um, but I have a lot of favorites. I really love, um, uh, 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 Swoobat and Woobat. They're some of my favorites. Uh, I like, um, what's it? Uh, Noivern. A lot, pretty much all of the bat Pokemon. They're some of my favorites. And then, um, I really like Gibble. And I like Kranidos. Um... It's really hard to just narrow it down to one favorite, so that's why I always just go with Bulbasaur, because he's been my number one favorite my whole life. Or, well, not my whole life, but for the 25 years that I've been playing Pokemon. Nice work. I'm hoping after this we can unlock a new map. Yeah, we'll keep that one. So, about the same. I think this one's cuter, the first one. Um... a better picture of it, I guess. Excuse me. Oof. So, I'm gonna have to play through this. Probably two or three more times. Okay. Path to the swamp. You discovered a route and... Okay, that leads to this one. Path to the swamp. Okay. Mm, what is the album? I guess I'll save that one of more lol. Because I feel like it's pretty cute. Real cute. Hmm. I'm gonna retry that one one more time at night, and then I might try um, going back to the other island at night. Samberry is raiding with eleven friends. Hello, hello, Sam. 
how are you? Welcome, Raiders. How's it going? I just started this level. I will catch back up to chat in just a moment, but welcome, Raiders. My name is Torn. I share this channel with my husband, Nerd Candy. Y'all might have been here before. Um, but yeah, welcome. We play a pretty big variety of games. <gasps> Look at that Arbok. <gasps> Can we wake it up? Okay. Really like, smack it. Oh, look at the baby. We love a big snake baby. I'm sorry, I'll be with y'all in just a sec. <laughs> I hope everyone is good. Thank you all so much for coming and raiding. Thank you so much, Sam. Um, I don't know if any mods are in the chat to give Samberry a shout out, but if not, I will do that in just a moment. Any of my lurkers, you should for sure give Samberry a follow. Because she's lovely and beautiful and sweet, and her little laugh makes me so happy. She has this like devious little laugh, or like like mischievous little laugh. It makes her seem like she's up to something. Also, I apologize if you can hear our dogs snoring. They're quite loud. They snore like grown men. Look at that baby. Can I feed it? Come, come, come. Oh, yes. Look at that baby. Oh, it's so adorable. Okay. Also, once again, our sound alerts on things like raids are not working tonight for some reason. So, uh, don't know what that's about, but I heard it and that's all that matters, right? Ugh. Oh, is that a toucan? Wait, what is that? Two cannon! Okay, sweet! Can I wake it up? I was wondering what those nests belong to. It's not a very good picture, but it's better than nothing, because I didn't have anything on them. Also, I have learned that I crane my neck upwards, trying to get the camera to move up, so that's a weird thing I do. <laughs> good time. They can't be bothered. Can I hit one of the magic heart? Okay, they don't seem to be responding to this. They don't care. There's got to be more things hiding in these bushes. There's got to be more Pokemon. I just knew it. And there's something... <gasps> what is that? Is that a Wobbuffet? That has to be a Wobbuffet, right? Come on now. Get your ass out here. Get up. Oh, yep, 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 yep. Yes, Wooper. Okay, not Wobbuffet. Wobbuffet's the later... Oh my goodness. Come here, my child. You adorable little baby. After I just hit you in the head with an apple. <gasps> Action shot. Oh, I missed it. Lame. Okay, well, at least I found a new one. I got photos of two more that I didn't have before. I'm just kind of hurling things around, trying to <laughs> trying to make something happen. It's bound to pay off eventually. I still... Okay, I still have not figured out what is in this cave, or like, how to... how to interact with whatever is supposed to be in here. There has to be a reason. <gasps> Volatile Paragon, thank you so much for the follow. How is it going? Okay, let me catch back up. Thank you all so much for the raid! Welcome, raiders! Um, hello again, June Gloom. Volatile Paragon, hello, hello. Thank you so much for coming in with the raid. Everyone take things so he will get distracted from taking photos. <laughs> it didn't work this time. Uh, oh, Sam, how is Persona 5 going? I see you're putting in more time on that. 
all the distract. <laughs> thank you for the shout out. Oh, no worries. Thank you, uh, June Gloom. I appreciate that. Um, of course, I was glad to do that for you. OMG, you are so sweet. Uh, no, not the lab. It's so cute. Like, really, like, I think it took me probably, probably like three streams before I noticed that you, you have your like little mischievous little laugh. And I just, it's so endearing <laughs> and so cute. The puffer snores, yeah. So my mom's dog is asleep right outside the door. She's a little miniature Australian Shepherd. She's a tiny little chonker, but she snores like a grown man and it's incredible. And then right behind the green screen, I have my doggo Moose, the big German Shepherd. And he's not snoring at all. He doesn't usually snore. So, I don't know. It's weird that the smallest one snores the loudest. But yes, thank you so much for the raid. What's up, everybody? Thank you, raiders, for coming in. As always, thank you for entrusting your community to come over to us. For us to corrupt them. I'm just kidding. I feel like you're as corrupt as we are, so you're fine. Mm, no, I'm not. Mm. That's a one star. We don't need a one star photo. Whooper is new. Let's see. What's the best photo we got? Mm, ooh. We did get a picture of him diving. Okay. So maybe we'll use that one. It's not the best, but it's like an action shot. So maybe. We'll check it out. Look at that baby. He's so cute. Oh my god, look at the little baby. I feel so bad throwing stuff at them. Okay, we're, we're submitting that one. And little baby Ariados eating his little apple. My heart. I love them so much. Okay, um, none of these are good. These are all absolutely atrocious, but at least it'll be in our book. I'll go with that one. Pick a pack, we don't need to do that. Okay. Yes. Go ahead and submit those. It'd be like that. And the small one's really making the most noise. Yeah, for real. Bab? Babby? My little babbies? A new discovery. I'm so thirsty. Arbok is Babby. <laughs> yes. Sweet, sweet Babby. Baby Babby. I don't know. I'm not up with, um... Whooper go whoopsie, yeah. Well, he intentionally... It looks like he was, like, falling off the rock. But he was intentionally doing it. He fine. Uh, first time you've gotten it as your subject. Okay. You know, not bad for a first one, I guess. Well, two copper stars. That's pretty much garbage. But it's fine. We'll get better ones. At least we know where it's hiding now. But there's... Okay. There's a cave in this map, and then in the other map, there is ancient ruins, and there's got to be something in there that you can coax out with either the fluff fruit or the Illumina orbs, but I haven't figured it out yet. I tremble if I met one up close. Nice work. That baby is fine. Okay, we're gonna go with that one because it's super cute. Okay, this one has got to be better of Ariados. But yes, how is Persona 5 going? I assume it's still going well. And, oh, did you finish the, um, what do you call it? The Kathy, was it Kathy Rain that you were playing the other day? Did you end up finishing that one? Uh... Your Turnip Comrade. I love the name. Hello. Thank you so much for the follow. How's it going? Welcome. Okay, we've got two cannon. This is a garbage picture, but at least we'll have them registered. Okay, that works. Yeah. Oh my god. Is that a possum emote? Oh my god. We're gonna be like besties, aren't we? <laughs> I adore possum babies. <laughs> Just tagged in from the raid, going sleepies now, have a good stream. Alright, thank you so much for uh, coming in with the raid, and thank you for the follow. Hopefully we will see you around. Have a wonderful night. I hope you have some pleasant dreams, or unpleasant dreams, whichever one you prefer. 
Um, okay, so I've got, I've only got like 2,000 points to the next level, so I guess I should try again, but I think I'm going to retry during the daytime, maybe, if it'll give me the option. Oh no, it just puts me back at night. Okay. My god, I need that possum emote. It's so cute. Oh my god, that's your emote. Ooh, I'm gonna give you a follow later. Come let me throw things at you. I don't think we're waking Arbuck up. I don't think he can be bothered. No. And I know there's some other things out in the forest. <gasps> there we go. Okay. Oh, I'm never going to get a good picture of them. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to throw things at your heads. But you won't cooperate. So I have to beat you into submission. Look at its little stupid derpy face. I love it so much. I just want to squeeze them until they die. My cute rage, like playing this game, is barely containable. trying to throw fruit at a plant, but okay. Come on, lady what I mean, lady in. Wake up. Do something. Entertain me. Oh, they're cute. I need to look at the map more closely so that I can memorize like where um, where like the cave is and everything. Cause I need, I feel like I need to be more prepared as far as where to look for some of these. Okay, we're gonna start throwing towards the ancient ruins. There's got to be something down there. Thing? Come on now. Alright, and after this, I think I should have another map unlocked. I hope, anyway. Because, like, as much as I am enjoying this, I do want to, you know, move on to something else. Because I've replayed these quite a few times. So far, my stream has gone for five hours, and I've played two maps, so... <laughs> Part of that's on me, because I'm very talkative, but... Wake up. Let's see if we can get a better picture. <gasps> look how cute. Oh, look at him dancing. <gasps> oh, there's another one. Oh my goodness. Oh, so cute. Hit right in the face. No, don't tell me to leave. I don't want to leave. Work it, Magic Heart. Work it, honey. I'm gonna find out what's in these freaking caves and these freaking ruins. I don't want to Google it, but I also do kind of want to Google it. I'm like, maybe, maybe if ten apples won't do it, then maybe fifteen apples will do it. Wait, wait. That looked like there was something hanging from the ceiling. 
I don't know. I could be wrong. But, um... <clears throat> All the cuteness with possum BBs. Yes, I love possums. I love them so much. If it weren't for the fact that my hand isn't great right now, I'd be buying and playing this game like mad. It's so cute. And, like, the colors are just so vibrant and everything about it is just so soothing to me. Even though it's very repetitive, I'm kind of into that. I'm just... I don't know. Something about the repetition just makes me feel calm. Oh, may it be like that? The amount of times games go longer or streams is because I'm enjoying the chat with everyone. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> That's my thing, is, like, I end up talking a lot, and I can't, I can't multitask. I've never been good at that. So, uh, yeah, I end up getting very far behind in the game. Good lord, look how cute they are. Okay. Let's see. Hmm. I guess this is the closest one. Well, technically that's the closest, but this one has multiples in it. So I'm going to submit that one. <clears throat> Let's go with that. Magikarp looks so stupid, but I love it. Uh, no more good ones. Oh, wait. <clears throat> so... Oh! So I got credit for taking pictures of the ancient ruins. I wonder if I can take a picture of the cave. <sighs> Interesting. Mine is usually, I think, because I play such story-heavy games that I don't want y'all to miss out, so I try to talk in between, and then it makes it longer. Oh, yeah. That's what was happening with me when I was walking, or when I was playing through The Walking Dead. There's so little time to, um... Like, there's a, a lot of story, and, like, the voice actors are doing all the work. Like, they're narrating everything. And if you... If I turn away for a second and start talking, I miss, like, important plot points or I miss a quick decision or a quick time event. So yeah, I'll I'll play the game and then talk for 15 minutes and then go back to the game. So it takes me forever to get through it. So um, yeah, I feel that. Woo woo. I just like playing for hours on end. When I move out of my parents' home and don't have anything to do the next day, I will do 24 hour streams. Woo! Props to you. We were talking about that last night. I can easily do a 12 hour stream, but 24 hours, I would be so grouchy and not how I want to present myself on stream uh, that it would not be worth it for me to do a 24 hour stream. <laughs> so, um, hold on one second. Let me go back. I've got to uh, follow the person with the adorable possum emotes. And Volatile Paragon, do you also stream? <clears throat> I have insomnia, so I might as well do something that means I have fun. Yes, um, same. I mean, it is almost 4 a.m. for me. Last night I streamed until 6.30 a.m. or 7 a.m. So yeah, I'm up all night as well. I feel you. Um, you do? Okay, cool. I will give you a follow then. We gotta support each other, right? All us, all us smaller streamers, we gotta support each other. A clown god who likes games. Okay. Hey, we'll go with it. Up all night to get lucky. Right? That's what we're here for. Ugh, this stupid chair. I hate how much this chair squeaks. Uh, whatever. This professor's kind of a dick when it comes to rating pictures, but whatever. Essentially the same. Uh, I think I'll go with this one still. I love that song. That song's gonna be stuck in my head now. <laughs> yeah, we are all very much nighttime people here. Well, I mean, there are some people who are across the globe where it's like daytime. But most of us US people are just all night owls. Nice work. 
I got a better picture of Magikarp finally. Okay, well I'm glad I was snapping that pick then. Okay. Pretty incredible. Interesting. Staying up hella late. Yeah. Yeah, like last night I really shouldn't have, but I played I played through the entirety of Little Misfortune and then I needed to do uh, a villager hunt on Animal Crossing. So I started that and I ended up staying up till like 7 a.m. Knowing full well that I had to be up at 10 a.m. to take my mom to a doctor's appointment. So I only slept like three hours. I was super tired and I felt so bad for not raiding because we had like 40 people or something in here. And I was like, I knew I should raid, but I was so tired. The dogs needed to eat. Uh, Hasiel was getting up and getting ready for work. So I was just in a rush and I didn't raid and I felt so bad for not raiding. But, you know, sometimes you just can't. <laughs> so... Uh, it was great though. I loved it. Oh yeah, yeah. I, for I, I forgot you were in here for a while. You were in and out most of the night. Um, okay. So did we unlock, okay. By the way, thanks to the progress you've made in your research, I've got something to report. Sweet. I hope we have a new map. I'll fill you in once all the photos are squared away. I think you'll be pleased to hear this. See what I'm worried about though. I've been streaming for over five hours now and I know once a new map, unlocks I'm gonna want to replay it like five or six times we'll see hey you want to know a fun fact about an ancient Greek actor who wait ancient Greek actor who messed up so bad people nay nay on him even today nay nay isn't what like the old school dance but sure yes <laughs> go for it let us know Oh. Oh no, none of those were good. Mm. This one's kind of cute because he kind of looks so stupid. So we'll go with that right now. Mm, no. What'd that mouth do though? Okay, I think that's all I'm gonna do. Turn to camp. No, like, they make fun of him. Wonderful, okay. Imagine you are a regular person in the wonderful year of 408 BC. You are watching the play Orestes by the famed Euripides. Oh, what's happening? We've got new islands to explore now. Yes! I pinpointed two teleportation points we can use. Ooh, where? One on this long, narrow island, and another offshore in the middle of the water. Ooh. Voluka Sweltering Sands. Okay, that Voluka makes me think of the band Veruca Salt, which is one of my... I wouldn't say a favorite man, but I do love them. Maricopia, Blushing Beach, okay. Okay, um, so we can go to either one. Captain Vince never got to that spot offshore, did he? This is gonna be amazing. I'll let you decide what order you want to visit them in. Keep up the good work. Yes. You see as Arrest is played by, oh, these are some names. I'm not going to attempt to read those out loud because I know I'm just going to mess them up. I took Latin, not Greek, so. <laughs> Talks to Electra and goes on a rant. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Okay. <clears throat> Todd, you are so handsome. <clears throat> I feel like I'm losing my voice. I think I'm going to test out one of these islands. And then I might end stream, maybe? We'll see. I am enjoying my research research jaunts. Thank you. Listen, I'm gonna tell you something. There's a feature I originally forgot to suggest to the professor. Professor. 
but I got to add it to your research camera. Uh, what kind of feature? It's a melody player. It lets your camera play a little tune. <gasps> Woo! A little music can prompt Pokemon to show you whole new sides of themselves. Wow. Sounds awesome. Rita. Could you fill in on the details? Yeah. Sure thing. If you press R, a melody will play. While it's playing, you can press R again to make it stop. A little music could wake up sleeping Pokemon or make some Pokemon get up and dance. I haven't had a chance to try it though, so I'm no expert yet. So next, let's give it a whirl. Now, this man has to say the following line. After the storm, I see the calm sea again. Though, because this is Greek, he mispronounces the word, meaning instead of saying, I see the calm sea, he says, I see a weasel once again. We love a good weasel. Everyone wants to see a weasel rather than a calm sea. Thanks. Research on Beluga Island awaits. Um... Which one do we want to do? Pristine sands and pastel tones make for a serene shoreline. That looks really pretty. Or sweltering sands in a vast desert. Pokemon gather at a small oasis to relax. Causing other playwrights to make callbacks to him, making fun of his incorrect words and his weasel seeing eyes to the point where he is well known in the theater world now in 2021. Interesting. I have, I'm not, I was never a theater kid. Uh, I always admired the theater kids, but um, I did not know that, so thank you for that. Interesting fun fact. No. I think we're going to go to the beach. We're going to do the beach thing. Um, I don't know how many times we're going to go through it before I wrap up the stream. I might... It's 4 a.m. now. I don't know. We'll see. <clears throat> What are my eyes seeing? A Pokemon Snap game? Good morning, Coffee Sean. How's it going? I see that you survived your terrible day yesterday. Um, and you'll be happy to know that I was with you in your misery. I also had a terrible day uh, yesterday. <laughs> but we both survived, and that's what matters. But yes, this is my first time playing Pokemon Snap on uh, the Switch. I am absolutely loving it so far. It is so fun and colorful and really brightens my mood. So yes, it's great. I love mythology and ancient plays and stuff. Hey, there's nothing wrong with that. Mythology is awesome. Like there is some really cool mythology out there. Um, recently, I've been reading through a book by Neil Gaiman called Norse Mythology, which is a lot of, um, you know, a lot of the Norse myths, some of the bigger ones get explored, but he tries to explore some of the Oh, Journey Home is raiding with eight friends. Journey Raid, hello, hello. And Batty Bean, hello, welcome back. You raided us last night with a huge raid. Okay, let's do some shout outs. Hold on. Okay, yes, thank you for the shout out, June Gloom. Uh, Y'all should follow. Um, oh my gosh. Hello, raiders. <laughs> I'm overwhelmed right now. Um, how is it going? Journey Home, thank you so much for the raid. Thank you for bringing over your community. How is it going? You were playing Pokemon Platinum. Nice. How's that going? I hope it's going well. We love us some Pokemon here. This is my first Pokemon game since I've been streaming, and I love Pokemon. But I'm always worried that people are going to judge my, uh, my gameplay styles and my teams. So I haven't played any on here. But I figured Pokemon Snap could be fine, right? Guys, Baby Verve is still alive. Survived two nights already and is eating better than me. Awesome! That's I'm so happy to hear that he's still alive. Okay, um... Okay, Raiders, uh, for anyone who doesn't know me, um, this channel is Them Filth Goblins. I am Torn. The other goblin is my husband, Nerd Candy. He will probably be playing uh, sometime during this week. Uh, I'm not really sure which weekday, but he'll probably be playing something. Uh, I play more chill games. He plays a little bit more complicated games because he has a lot more skill than I do. But uh, yeah, welcome. Thank you guys for stopping by. I appreciate it. And yes, thank you for the shout out for Batty Bean. Um, oh wait, Batty Bean was the one playing Pokemon Platinum and Journey Home was playing DVD. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Okay, my bad, I'm sorry for the mix up. There's a lot happening here and I get overwhelmed. Uh, I totally judge you on your gameplay. Um, more so if you do better than me. Oh no, I, <clears throat> I am not a professional. Even though I've been playing Pokemon my entire life, I'm not a professional. 
I love that you were using the nameplate. Oh yes, Journey Home, I forgot. So Journey Home made this for me. It was his suggestion because um, a lot of times when people raid into the channel, uh, it's a little bit confusing knowing who's Torn <clears throat> and who is Nerd Candy. So yes, Journey Home made this for me and I love it. Uh, I still need to uh, get one made for Nerd Candy. But yes, thank you so much, Journey Home. How was DVD? How were your matches? Uh, Batty Bean. Um, everybody should follow Batty Bean. I think they just recently got affiliate, I believe. Uh, I haven't had a chance to catch any of their streams yet. But they are a lovely person. They brought in a huge raid last night. Very kind of them. Journey Home is a friend of ours who has raided us a few times now. They have very chill streams. So please, please, please drop both of them a follow. Sorry, I got distracted from playing the game. But I hope everyone is doing well. If I missed anything in chat, I apologize. We just opened up a new map here on Pokemon Snap. So I'm pretty excited. <laughs> oh my god, it looks so pretty. Okay, I will be back with chat in just a moment. <clears throat> yes, just hit affiliate. Thanks for the shout out, Torn. How are you doing? I am doing well. Ooh, I'm so excited. Okay. Oh my goodness, look how cute. Okay. I am overwhelmed with the cuteness and the bright, happy colors of this game. It's a lot. There's so much going on. Come. Yes. Oh. Work it, honey. Give it to me. Serve. Okay. <clears throat> oh, can we make our hula? Hold on. Nope. Did we anger it? I've got to keep in mind, I only have 60 more photos left. I don't want Pikachu. Gross. Who cares? No one cares. There's got to be something in there, right? Okay. Oh, Blossom. Okay. Oh. Okay, what is this? Blossom, come out. Come on now. Okay, I don't... Why can't I get out of this mode? Okay, they're not reacting. I don't know... Oh, stop pressing that, Joshua. What are you doing? Okay. Why did I stop? What am I stuck on? Oh. An executor is in the way. Okay. Move. All right, I guess we can continue on. Thank you for the alert journey. Uh, stepping away to get comfy. Oh, no worries. I do not blame you. I need to start doing that myself. Last night, I stayed up until sunrise, and I did not need to do that. It was a mistake. Ooh. I love Wingle. So cute. Okay, this is my first time on this map, so I know I'm going to miss a lot. I apologize. God, look how cute they are. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, they look so derpy and stupid. I love it. Oh, I missed whatever I was supposed to scan. I was distracted. I'm going to have to replay this again. There's just so much to look at. Oh, we're going up and over. Okay. <gasps> a Finneon! <gasps> look at the Finneon! Oh, look how pretty! Okay, they're already gone. <gasps> Is it a Corsola? Is that a... Yes. Oh, God. Also, please don't judge me. I crane my neck upwards in this game because I think it's going to move the camera. It does not. Clearly. There's gotta be something swinging around out here. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, is that a sunfisk? Oh, they're so hideous. I love it. 
or stun piss. Yeah. Shovel. Okay, that's weird. I guess that'll come out at night, whatever it is. Oh, that's cute. Okay. Okay. <gasps> no, that's just a shovel. Will you react to music? Look at its stupid face. <laughs> I mean, it is a brawler, so I guess it's been beat up a little bit. Okay, um... Doo -doo 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 -doo. Yes, the design is lovely. Areas are beautiful. My favorite is the reef area. I just love coral reefs. Ooh, I can't wait. Like, I'm so excited to, like, check out this whole game. Uh, but yes, congratulations, Betty Bean, on hitting affiliate. That's awesome. That's, uh, like... Getting past that, like, that hurdle, it's not, I feel like it takes so long because, like, even though, you know, it doesn't sound like much uh, to try to get, like, three average viewers and the number of follows, sometimes it really does take a while to, to make that happen. So congratulations. Uh, do, do, do. Let me see. Don't try to get everything on the first run. Take note of the things of interest and return to them in the next run. Thank you. Uh... Oh yes, and that is my Switch code. If anybody wants to add me on the Switch, feel free. Um, Diz is you. Yes, I am Diz. Um, there we go. <laughs> Thank you for sending that friend request. Yeah, it's a bigger goal than one would think. Yeah, it truly is. Because, like, even, like, I had, you know, luckily I had some friends and family helping me out. But even then, trying to get the average of three viewers was so difficult for me. I was like, surely I'm going to hit it this time. And then you would look and no. And then you would try another time. And he'd be like, okay, I know I got it this time. No. So congratulations again. That's fantastic. Uh, hopefully I can catch one of your streams here soon. Do you have a set streaming schedule yet? Or are you still just kind of like whenever you get the chance to, you do it? Request sent. I'm going to run my snap too. Okay, cool. I will, uh, I will accept your friend request right after I get off, um, well, I guess I can go ahead and, go ahead and add, uh, that way I don't forget, uh, friend request, there we go, mm -hmm. okay, yay, thank you for the friend request, alright, let's get back to it. At the moment, I don't. It's an average of every other day around 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Okay, for sure, streaming tomorrow. Nice! Okay, I will do my best to catch it. Um, I work... Unfortunately, I, w I go to work at 6.30 p.m. I work 12-hour shifts. Uh, so, I work tomorrow night. I will do my best to catch your stream. Because sometimes, if work is kind of chill, I'm able to catch some streams. If not, I will at least try to uh, drop a lurk. Okay, also, you might hear my dog Moose moving around behind the green screen, and I hope he doesn't. You want out, Bobby? Oh. Uh, my game list is too long. Oh, honey, if I could show you the stacks of games and how many, like, I have so many things. Like, I haven't started Graveyard Keeper. I haven't started Jenny LeClue or that, or, like, I still need to finish Muta Zion. Uh, I need to get, I, I haven't played The Gardens Between. I have so many, so many games that I need to play. I'm doing my best to work through them, but I just keep buying more, and they just keep piling up more and more. So, oh, no, 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 that's not what I wanted. Look how stupid it looks. I love it. Hi, doggo. Yes, that was my doggo, Moose. He was sleeping comfortably in here, but 
he has decided he wanted to go into a, the other room. Oh, my tummy. What do you think you are uh, going to be playing next, Coffee Sean? Heading to bed. Good night, everyone. Good night, June Gloom. Thank you so much. Oh, oh, oh. Y'all, if you're not following June Gloom, I will disown you and unfollow you if you do not um, follow June Gloom. Because June Gloom means so much to me and is a wonderful streamer. One of my favorite, favorite people. Their streams are my favorite on Twitch. Uh, good night, June. I hope you sleep well. Get some rest. But yes, June Gloom is great. They play a wide variety of games. Uh, they like RPGs. They like cutesy stuff like Animal Crossing. Um, but lately, they've also been doing story games like Tell Me Why and Life is Strange. So please, please, please drop them a follow. Shameless self-promotion time. Oh! My bad. <laughs> I am so, like, forgetful. But yes, Coffee Sean also is working towards affiliate. So if y'all want to drop her a follow, she would very much appreciate that. I know she's getting close to it. Um, I run to follow June. June is amazing. I love June. I know I feel weird saying that because I've only known him for, like, six months or so. But he real good people. I can tell, so... Don't expect much. Whatever, June. I sprint to follow Coffee. <laughs> Coffee is very sweet. I've only been to, uh, like, I think one or two of their streams. I think I was lurking in one and active in another. But um, they're working on getting a capture card um, so that they can play more games on stream. But yes, all lovely people. All lovely people, truly. Mm, all of these are kind of terrible. But I guess we'll do this one. June is really lovely and very chill. Yeah. Everybody in my chat that knows June can vouch for how wonderful his streams are. I know I got better pictures of Stunfist than that, right? Wow. Okay, apparently not. Ugh. I guess we'll do this one then. These are terrible. Good God, look how adorable they are. If you want to spend my B-Day this week with me, though... Ooh! It's your birthday week, Coffee Sean? When is your birthday? I feel like you told me. I feel like we literally had this discussion. And my memory is just terrible. But, um... Not Sean playing on our emotion. <laughs> Hey, you know what? Whatever works to uh, get the views, right? Pancake fish. I love Stunfisk. He's such a weird Pokemon. 15th. Okay, cool. So it's getting close then. Do you have any big plans? Or are you doing like a 12-hour birthday stream or anything crazy like that? But love y'all. Have a wonderful night. Good night, June. Sleep well. We will see you soon. Did I really just get this one picture of Finneon that really, like, far off? <sighs> Whatever. Whatever. We're gonna do better this time. <laughs> Look at its little happy face. Oh my goodness. Now Moose is wanting back in here. Oh, wait, what? I didn't get a clear picture of it? Oh. You cannot select photos in which the Illumina phenom phenomenon isn't shown. Huh. Okay. My bad. F my pictures then, right? Tyler Oaks, Regine Hydrate, thank you. I am getting quite parched, and my throat is getting kind of sore because I've been talking for almost six hours. Chris of the day off, and I'll sleep till, like, 7, because baby bird... Oh, that's so sweet that you're, like, prioritizing the baby bird's uh, well-being. That's very sweet. A new discovery. Nice work. All right, we got one diamond star. We will take it. Executor. A, new discovery. A very derpy nice Pokemon. One diamond star for that one. Stunfisk. I doubt we're going to get a diamond star for this one, but we'll see. 
Okay, you know, two copper stars. We'll, we'll take it. Wingull, not the best picture. Not centered, but kind of a close picture. Oh, nice. Okay, that's not bad. One gold star. We'll take it. I'm trying to like kind of zoom through these because I want to get back and play the the map again. So, um, oh, so cute! Throwing fluff fruit or running scans might get Pokemon to pay. Really, running a scan? Huh. I'm limited on PC games, but I've got some puzzle escape games, some Final 15 probably. I'm still looking for something to capture my attention. Thinking of getting Stardew on PC as well. I also have Stardew on PC, but I have not, um, I haven't tried it yet on PC. I started it up the other night just to see if I could get it to project onto Streamlabs. So I might eventually try it. Um, but I'm about to start a multiplayer game on the Switch with some friends. Um, because I'm still really new to Stardew. Um, I haven't even finished my first year. I think I'm in fall. But yeah, uh, Stardew is always a good one. It's a very nice, laid-back, chill game. Uh, Puzzle Escape games are also fun. I feel like you mentioned that you downloaded some of the ones that um, Voter Mom had been playing, but I don't know if that's correct. OMG, spent an hour trying to get the puzzle game to show up. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah. I was trying to get um, a game called Seven Days to Die to show up the other day, and it would show up, but I wasn't able to see my chat at the same time. So there's not really much use in streaming a game if you can't acknowledge chat. So I've got to get that worked out. I'm still new to the whole PC gaming thing. It's a bit overwhelming. <laughs> you researched the Maricopia, I Maricopia Islands for the first time. Um, I don't feel like any of those photos are really, like, something I want to save, so... Well, maybe the course of the one. Let's save that one, because it's cute. Also, maybe the stupid derpy one. We'll save that one. Look how happy that baby is. That's how happy I look while I'm eating. Okay, we're gonna retry it. I had the black screen thing and had to Google graphic card fixes. Felt so accomplished. Oh, nice. Well, I'm glad you got it to work. It's so nice when something finally falls into place and works right. So I'm guessing this doesn't work on many. But I would think that on... Oh, wow. I have never seen a Wingle. I did not know that they flew like that. No, that's not what I meant to do. I want to get the Bell Awesome to, like, dance. You're stupid. I hate you, but I need a picture of you. Come on. Fine, okay, I ain't gonna chase you. You're not worth my time. How do I get them out here? Oh, I bet I can... There we go. Yes! Oh, they're so precious. Look at the babies. Oh my god, they're so cute. I can't stand it. Oh no. I didn't mean to hit you. I'm sorry, child. Go. 
Yeah, I would be very happy if we could get our audio issues worked out. But um, we seem to keep having problems. Like almost every single night. <laughs> oh. Show off. Oh, hot. Show us the muscles. Of course, my husband has made um, some sexy drawings of. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Oh. What am I supposed to be scanning? Artillery. Nice. Hmm. I don't think they're going to react to the music. Pikachu cannot. Okay, there we go. Don't tell me it's time. I don't want to leave yet. Let me do my thing. So many doggo snores. I know there's still stuff that I'm missing, but... Uh, all my max fruits, but why do the Illumina spots take so much to max out? I'm not sure what that means. I'm very new to this. I just started it tonight, so I'm not sure what, what, all, those, what all that means. There's always some technical issue messing things up. Yep, 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 yep. Because, honestly, things were working fine or no they weren't working saturday night but then sunday night they were working and now they're back to not work i i don't know one some order like that but we didn't change anything and some nights it'll work and sometimes it will or my brain isn't working whatever it's late i've been streaming for almost six hours so um and i haven't had much sleep today <laughs> forgive me for not speaking properly All right, let's submit some of these photos. Surely we have some better ones. Oh, do we want to do the one with multiples? Or do we want to do the one with cool background? I guess we'll do the multiples. Awesome. This one's gonna be difficult because I got a few cute ones, I think. Mm. I don't know, it's hard to tell because the other one has multiples and they're doing their dance. No, 
I guess I'll just do the, uh, the centered one. Mm, okay, I'll go with that one right now. No, I didn't take any of that one. Didn't take any of that one. That is a terrible shot, but okay. I assume that's the male pavilion. Hmm. I need to get that pose from the front when he's like flexing like that. So I think I'll have to run a scan whenever it's facing towards us. But I'm still gonna go ahead and submit that one. And I don't know if I should take an eating picture or if I should do the one where it's got the electricity. Hmm. Maybe this one. I'm, I'm gonna go with that. Hmm. I guess this one is centered. So I'll go with that. Okay. Oh, my contacts are drying out. <laughs> I need to end this. Okay. Yeah, I think once I turn these in, I will probably go ahead and wrap up, and we'll see if there is anybody on that we want to raid. Let's see. Let me start looking around a bit. I have to go see you later. Thank you for the great stream. Thank you so much, Ryan, for always hanging out. I appreciate your uh, your devotion to all of our little friend group. Uh, you are always there hanging out for us. So have a wonderful night. Sleep well. Going to go ahead and head out. Thank you for the chill stream. Good night, Drian. Thank you again for always being here uh, and hanging out for a while. Have a wonderful evening. And, of course, everybody follow everyone. Follow Drian. Follow Ryan. Follow Coffee Sean. Everybody follow everyone uh, because that's what we do here. Uh, we like to support each other. Mm, let's see. Pokemon Snap. See if anybody else is playing. Mm. Let's see. Okay. Oh, let, let's get through the the pictures first, and then we'll we'll worry about raining. Okay, so we got two stars for that one. A new discovery. Nice, work. nice. Got the diamond star for that one. <laughs> nice work. Uh, we can barely see this. Um... Good night, Angela. Next is Machamp. This is the first time we've gotten it as our subject. Okay, we got a gold star. Not bad. So does that let us unlock the night level? Also, uh, Coffee Sean, since you played this, do you does this automatically save, or do you have to uh, manually save it if you're still here? If not, don't worry. <laughs> Look at that. Uh, you've had a new stage in your research. Okay. Yes, auto save. Okay, cool. Thank you. Private beach. We've discovered a route on Blushing Beach that leads to a hidden beach. Two fighting type. Who's the other one? Who's the other one? Oh, I guess Crab Roller is fighting. Thanks to the progress you've made in your research, I've got something to report. I'll fill you in once your photos are squared away. I think you'll be pleased to hear this. Mm, we'll go ahead and return to camp. I don't think there's anything really worth saving. So while we're doing that... Um, let me see if I can find someone on Twitch. Now then. 
Oh, oh, oh. Sorry. I don't know if y'all can hear that, but let's see. Um, snap. Let's look for Pokemon Sword and Shield. I wish I knew how to do that filter. Oh, okay. There we go. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. Sorry, I'm trying to find somebody to raid. Hopefully this person is chill. Okay. Sorry if y'all hear some noise for a sec. But okay, we'll let their ad play. Um, and we'll check them out. Okay. Go back to the main screen and that loading flower animation means it's saving. They are saved now. Okay, thank you. Research on the beach is coming. You're about ready to move on to the offshore area. Oh, sweet. The Neo Con or the Neo One can travel over a reef just as well as over a river after all. Okay. Let's get ready for some reef search. No, 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 no. I don't want to do that yet. Okay. Reef. Yeah, I want to, but I've been going for six hours. I really need to wrap up. But um thank you all so much for being here. If you can stick around for the raid, that would be fantastic. If not, I definitely understand. I know it's late or or early. I don't really know. Um, hopefully this person is good. I don't know them, but hopefully they're a chill person. They're wearing a very cute onesie and they are playing Pokemon, uh, Sword and Shield. So, um, hold on one sec. Hopefully they're not ending. Okay. Um, oh, shice. Let me mute them for a sec. Okay, so we are gonna raid. If y'all wanna stick around for the raid, it would really be appreciated. If not, I understand. Uh, here's the raid message. If you are a follower, but not subscribed, uh, if you are subscribed, copy and paste this. Uh, our bot is not subscribed to us, but I promise if you copy and paste it and you are subscribed, the emotes will show up. So um, if we can get at least a few people going in with a raid, that would be great. Um, but if not, I understand, like I said, I know how it is, uh, but yeah. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and start up the raid. Let me... Okay. Okay, um, let me go ahead and start the raid. All right, thank y'all so much for being here and hanging out. I I know we say we appreciate y'all, but we really, really honestly do from the bottom of my heart. It's so nice to have y'all here. Like some of y'all come every single uh, stream and it's just so sweet. Let's see. Okay. All right, again, I don't know this person, but hopefully they're chill, hopefully they're nice. Um, obviously if they're not, feel free to leave. Um, but hopefully they're good people. If they are, feel free to drop them a follow, but all right, y'all have a wonderful night. Thank y'all so much. I'm going to start the raid and we'll be going over there here in just a moment. Y'all take care. Have a good night. I'm not sure when Hasiel will be streaming this week, but I promise, well, I can't promise, but he should be streaming sometime this week. All right. Bye y'all.